Hello and welcome to another run of Atomic Crops. So, uh, just to recap, so we won on year one, which is, you know, Ascension 1, the default base game, basically, um, with Atomic Crops the last time that we played. But then I played off stream um, year two and got a win. And so, you know, with that, I was feeling pretty good about uh, my Atomicroft's abilities. And so I was like, oh, well, you know, year three, this will be this will be no problem. Anyway, um, so I played a couple of year threes off stream and they've gone incredibly badly. I think I've made it to like maybe maybe summer, right? So um, yeah, they haven't gone particularly well. So what I'm trying to say is, oh my goodness, see, this is what I mean. Uh, prepare yourself for me to die a lot, is what I'm trying to say. And also, like, it, it's so interesting, because I'm like, these dots, you know, they have like a red outline, and they're like glowing, kind of blinding white, and it just feels like I'm not really sure how you can miss them. And then there I am, you know, missing them. Oh god, see, look at that, we've taken three damage on day one, just trying to like, I felt like I've been very not aggressive um, on some of these maps, and so I was like, oh, well clearly what will solve all of my problems is if I'm very aggressive and try to take out as many, like, field, uh, I don't know, points of interest, I guess, um, as fast as possible on day one, which, I mean, it's it's not like it's itself a horrible idea, but clearly it has not gone particularly well for me. I'd prefer to stay off of uh, one health. I feel like it would be much better if we could keep, you know, at least two lives. I mean, we have two heartbeat seeds already, which is pretty good. Um, for day one, I don't know that it makes up for these issues that we're going to face, but... Okay, I wish that thing would come back and not, like, adopt a different camp while it simultaneously, like, persists uh, in attacking me. Wish it wouldn't do that, to be honest. Thought it would be nice to get a tractor, but whatever. We can come back to it tomorrow. We can head back to the farm now. Oh, gosh. I should probably just keep shooting. You never know when you're going to run into, like, one of those Thunderbirds. Okay. Well, we have seven seeds. It's not uh, a lot of seeds, but it is not no seeds either, like we had earlier. See, and I hate to see that these little guys are, like ready already because I, I'm not going to harvest them yet because we're so close to having oh there we go I'm, I'm really struggling with like trying to multitask well when it comes to like the planting and uh how like you know you want to continue planting while simultaneously uh like attacking enemies and stuff and I feel like it's it's very easy to miss what you're trying to do there. Come on, finish with the fertilizer. That's clearly not been a good day for fertilizer. Well, at least we can accept that. And we still won't have anywhere near enough for a... Uh... Oh, jeez. I forgot that the slugs get so aggressive when you don't have anything down. I guess they don't have anything to eat. I guess they'll eat you. Uh, I don't think that's how slugs normally operate, I'll be honest with you. Um, I like to go on walks and I, I pretty frequently see slugs and, well, I, I guess I wouldn't know, right? Because there's always, uh, there's always been a lot of vegetation for the slugs to eat, so I suppose, um, you know, I wouldn't really know if the slugs were inclined to eat me or not. That's pretty clear now. Ah. <sighs> Whew, okay, so we survived the first day, um, which doesn't sound like an achievement, but wow, it is. I don't really torture myself. I like to just go over here and like see what's available, even though, you know, we only, we don't have any roses, so we couldn't possibly redeem them, and we just have to like accept this. How much these are selling for? Wow, 300 and 400, okay. Yeah, like, uh, the last run I had, I didn't even have enough money, um, for a... Um, I didn't even have enough money for a gun, uh, the entire spring, which was, I mean, it was impressive, I would just want to say. 
So, uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes. But, yeah, I'm like, oh. And, like, I, I can't believe, like, the, the difference, too, between, like, year two and three, even. Like, years one and three are, are you know, pretty dramatically different. But even just like year two and three, I was like, okay, well, two is like kind of kind of a breeze still. I was like, oh, this is easy, and there weren't really any moments where I was like, oh, I might not make it. And then, uh, and then here we are with year three, Ascension three, whatever. And I'm like, oh, this is this is awful. It's very hard. <laughs> so I don't know. Maybe it's like, and also, you know, I guess like the bullets get subtly faster, right? And so I think it's really interesting the way they kind of do that, the whole frog and boiling water thing to you. Um, I should probably take out this camp before I do this fight. I think that that is probably like the smartest, and by smartest, I mean like the only sensible thing I should do here. Okay. Yeah, you too. That includes you. And, I mean, maybe even you if you're gonna hang out here. Okay, perfect. At least we got a seed out of it. I mean, that's better. The Thunderbirds usually drop nothing, which kind of makes sense since in this parlance they're sort of just shadow creatures. Um, and I suppose shadow creatures are not known for giving you much of tangible value. Okay, we should start walking it back. Okay, nice. Wow, even a heartbeat seed. I mean, that's pretty good. Especially with me on two hearts. Okay. Well, I mean, a stat up isn't incredible, but... I mean, I mean, it is, it is, but like, you know, if we got something like Atomic Orchid, you know, then we, uh, we could have no complaints. We'd be laughing, you know? Okay, maybe this will be good. Let's kill this one first. I know, I know, we only have seven seconds, so it's probably not a great use of resources, but... Um, wow, two different herds. Look, they're even different species. Very nice. I mean, let's just do Birch Killer. Like, for real? Like, we're having such issues with them? Well, let's just do that, so they should die as I approach them, yeah? That's how it works. Seems like it's going well. I'm a pretty big fan of that. Okay. I guess we just do this last one. And then, I don't know, I guess let my crops get eaten. I mean, I wish I wouldn't, but... We are here. Wow, seven rose seeds, not bad. Okay. Cool. Oh my god, I went the wrong way again. I've gotta, like, start using my map. I mean, it's crazy, because, like, I'm always, I'm always like, oh, you know, use your map, use your map, to, like, um, like, friends when we play Apex, you know? Oh gosh, I already sound obnoxious, which I suppose I am, but, um... Oh god, I just, I just stopped, like, being, I must have clicked out of the screen somehow? Anyway, that went, uh, well for the slugs, I guess. Okay, watch out for that. Okay, don't die. Okay, there's no point in dying with three heartbeat seeds on you, that's just an embarrassment. Don't die that way. I probably should not have let them accumulate on the farm for like two waves before I came back here. I think that's probably actually not not super good for my, my continued survival. Okay. Yep, cool. Oh great, now the slug is gonna go so aggro on me. Yeah, this pea shooter gun, it's uh it's not so great. Maybe I should take the weeds cut faster since we're obviously gonna have to cut like a ton of weeds here. Okay, well, that's fine. You know, we'll get these down. Maybe I should go ahead and just like start. What? Oh god, I didn't finish that one? Like how close do I let us get to this and then just fail to finish it? Okay. Um, hmm. We didn't grow any roses. We have a bunch of rose seeds. We didn't grow any roses. 70. And 150, wow, and then that would be the one uh, heartbeat seed I'm looking for. It's, it's painful. It's painful. Gourd is nice. We can't afford any of this stuff. Don't look at it. Okay, the Catling Gun is alright. I mean, it takes a little bit to ramp up, but it's okay. Okay. I mean, at least I'm buying a gun uh, before year, or you know, before... Gosh, I don't know. Should, should we put one down? Maybe we should, like, put it down right here. And, and that way, like, we could theoretically grow, like, a four square if, you know, if luck be a lady tonight or whatever. Okay. Okay, cool. Alright, we'll let that guy get some water and then we'll go and... There's not really that much left in the desert. Perhaps we should just leave and just go for the other one. I think that might be worth it. Mmm, we got a date tree. That's nice. I probably want to make sure that I grow some roses before tomorrow. 
Okay, let's kind of get this ramp up going so we can kill these bats without them swarming me. Oh my goodness. Okay, roaches. I mean, what the hell? You guys are all supposed to die. Okay, there we go. Oh man, another turret would be nice, but I guess I'll take a chicken. I guess I am having some issues with like there being weeds just all over everything in a way that's kind of frustrating. Okay, we'll be able to get these guys like ASAP. The tree guardian from over here, which is valuable. Gosh, I don't even know. We don't even get like that many crops down yet. Oh. Okay. I, I did kind of mean to spin up first before this, but it's fine. We, we love a challenge, you know? Backup generator, we'll do the rose thing, changing day length, that seems valuable. That is another heartbeat seed. Okay, well, let's try it. Okay, um, I, wished, I wish that we had not summoned uh, a bunch of bats, but that's okay. Uh, come on. Okay, resilience is cool. Oh my god, please. This is like not how I want to die. I mean, I'm like, this might be part of it too, you know? Um, just the fact that like I insist on running around when like I obviously have no, um, okay, you, stop it. Uh, when I don't have any, we, we're gonna have to kill these before they kill me. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, see, this is not great. Okay, and then we need to finish this one here. Okay, we got that out of the way. Okay. And we can go ahead and just empty a clip here. And then perhaps everything will be better soon. Okay. You guys, I cannot afford to have you eat the heartbeats. That's not very cash money of you. Okay. Now we just need the fertilizer to combine them. Oh my god, oh my god. Wow, okay. Oh wait, Monster Pod's still alive? It's probably like eating my crops. Yes, that's what it's doing. Okay, cool. Okay, now I need to try to add these together. Okay. We didn't lose that rose seed, thank god. Okay, and now this is all together. Who's, who's shooting me from over here? And do the, will they provide me with fertilizer? Because God knows that's what I need. Okay, the resilience situation is interesting over here. I really thought with two chickens, uh, things might go a little smoother for us, but that, that's that got to be a no on that one, huh? So this one's still not fully... There we go. Okay, that's going to be good. It's fully um, fertilized now as well. You can tell with the glowing, although I feel like I'm not very good at seeing the glowing. Okay, look at that. So we might survive for, I don't know, a little bit longer. Wish the roses would spread onto the hard dirt. Or the heartbeat seeds, man. That really would have been nice. Where where are they? Okay, is that is that everybody? I mean that doesn't seem right, does it? I don't feel like that seems right. Okay, yeah, so let's get this out of the way. And then we probably should like, I don't know, like over here we could probably just plant a tree or something. You know, that seems valuable. We have what, peach trees and date trees? Oh god, and then I have to like try to figure out which one's which. It's fine, it's fine. Okay, so we're gonna put a peach tree down here, because it's the peach and the apple trees that look the same. But not to be, you know, again, a peach or apple tree bigot, um, but I do think they look pretty similar. So, yeah, we didn't have any roses, which sucks. Um, we will not be getting married, obviously. We still don't have enough for a better gun. Oh my god. This is so painful! God, I love Daily Orchard. And I mean, the cow bucket one is actually quite nice as well. I don't know that we made enough to fully stuff. No, god. Well, I mean, at least they're not starving this year, but we did pretty bad. Um, okay, so we got th two pigs. Two pigs and one chicken? I thought we had two chickens. Okay, well, really, I don't know what I'm talking about. Good to know, though. <laughs> you know, you never want to be like, I know they say ignorance is bliss, right? But like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not buying that crap. Um, yeah, but I mean, I, I'd hate to not know that I was incompetent, you know? Okay, well, we're not going to be, yeah, I don't know, this might be more of a, you know, a, a celibate farmer's life. I don't know if we're going to be 
getting married this at this rate, you know? Certainly not with a... Uh... Okay, so maybe here I'll put down another tree. I mean, I know, I know about the, the tree situation. Really? Okay, there we go. Okay, I know we need to get out of here. I know we do, I know we do. Let's go ahead and put this here. This way we'll have a tree going, which is great. And then we can worry about the four squares once we've... Oh my gosh, please. Worry about four squares once it seems like we could, you know, have one. Okay, like this one. This would be a nice place for a four square. Come on, chickens. Do your work. Okay. Oh, now we'll have a longer day, which is actually super valuable since I just wasted a ton of time here. I mean, it's not a waste. Um, I like how resilience has already made the crops spread out. That's pretty fun. Okay, let's get these guys together. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so it's kind of like, you know, some extra crops, which, I mean, clearly we need. Uh, I'm going the wrong way. Let's take this this way. I don't think this is very... It's not that fast, but it's okay. There's nothing down here, right? I mean, we're already basically to the bottom of the screen, so I should... Oh, okay, no, completely wrong. Nice, nice. I mean, it looks like there's so much more... Okay, anyway, I'll quit rambling there. Or at least just, you know, quit having wishful thinking about there being more closer to me. More points ventures close. Okay, well now we're about to have, oh my god, um, <laughs> probably a bad time. No, but like another chicken, because the weeds are getting absolutely out of control on this farm. I suppose this does kind of, uh, oh, okay, yeah, see, I thought so. So now we need to just do this and then use the earthquake one, and then that way we don't miss out on a scroll. It would suck to miss out on a scroll. Okay, those guys, I just, I don't know, I don't really want to, I don't want to mess with them if I don't have to, you know? Love that the roaches are still trying to snipe me from, like, about a mile away. Jeez, you guys. Like, get a hobby or something, you know? Oof. It is interesting how you get kind of used to, like, the, the knockback that some of the guns have, and then, you know, when it disappears, um, you'll die over it. <laughs> but, you know... That's fine. I mean, I guess it's sort of like how, um, I mean, a much less complicated example, but similar to how, um, you know, some people are like the recoil patterns for, um, uh, Apex, you know, like the recoil patterns for each different gun, which is like, Jesus. But, you know, more power to them. Okay, well, you need some water, clearly. Uh, that's crazy that those plants that are, like, growing on the earth. Uh, the resilience crops, they, like, don't need their own water either. They'll just take care of the, all that for themselves. I mean, good for them. Okay, wow. Let's not die. That's my, that's my thinking. Okay. Oh, cool. We'll get more money from these. Tundra seeds. We don't have any of those. And then this is a plains garden bed. I mean, that would be better because we have plain seeds. Oh, my God. Okay, I should also think about how I do that too, right? Because I should make sure that we don't, um... Okay, go away. You too. Also go away. Oh, that was the sound of another wave starting, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. Okay, so I need to make sure that wherever we put the garden beds, it doesn't get in the way of where the trees are. So we should actually probably put the garden bed, like, down here. And it would be best, of course, to, like, butt it up against, um, empty soil you know, not, not tilled soil, so that, okay, there you go, beautiful, you'll love to see it, okay, I don't think we've gotten, well, I don't know, I mean, we're sitting at, like, 400 cashews, maybe things are okay, I don't know, let's combine these guys, I think we can do that, okay, yeah, you guys should probably go away, and then we got some cactus seeds, we'll put those down, hey, maybe you should die, um, cool. This poor tree. I'm just refusing to water the trees. Okay, there we go. Finally. Don't have enough fertilizer for either of y'all, which is a real shame. Okay, we got a little more. Not bad, not bad. Don't want to have to water all four of them, I'll tell you that much. But, okay, okay. I mean, okay, this is clearly the best day we've had, although it's mostly thanks to berries, which is embarrassing. Embarrassing, huh? Huh? <laughs> 
Okay, uh, that's not bad. We can take that. I don't care that much about an extra tractor charge, given that I don't have a tractor. I think that seems reasonable. Oh, man, I'd love a jackrabbit, but we can't afford that. Uh, I'm gonna hold my money rather than buy seeds. I mean, it seems like getting a gun upgrade at some point would be a lot more valuable. Plus, we're gonna have to spend money to go across the pond today. I think that's, I think that's a thing. Oh, it's my growth aura. For some reason, I thought it was the turret growth aura. Well, that's handy. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and throw down some seeds before we leave so that um, we'll have some available, even if they don't make a four square, like that's okay. I do have the turret in like the completely wrong place though. I should do something about that. Okay, you should probably die. Wow, you're still alive, huh? Okay, a little resilient crop, you can go. Oh God, dang it. Okay, whatever. Let's get out of here before I make any more mistakes. Uh, I see you go up to the tundra biome, that's fine. I say that's fine. Like, honestly, the tundra and the jungle biomes are both, you know, more difficult. And, oh god, anytime I take those speed mushrooms, I go way too fast. And then I just put myself in quite a bit of harm's way. And that's alright. Yeah, definitely where I'm- oh god, I don't even know which one I hit. I think I hit the fertilizer one, actually. So, that's okay. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> we're having some fertilizer problems as it was. See, like, killing the beast and it's supposed to get you, like, seeds and stuff, too. But when it doesn't, I'm just, like, it just makes me feel bad about killing them, you know? Aren't they, like, an endangered species, you know? I'm not sure to wipe them out. I mean, they're very cute, at least. Okay, what do we have? Squirt gun. Huh. I, I don't know what that means, so I'm gonna take it. I, I think that perhaps we're going with an ignorance is bliss theming today. Uh... Because I'm just like, oh yeah, that, that seems reasonable. I have no idea what that is, so we should take it. Okay, that's good. We have a tractor, at least. I have to remember what the tractor button is. Something weird. I think it's like one, maybe? Sounds right. Okay, having three heartbeat seeds. That makes me feel good. We just need one more, and then we can um, afford the inevitable. You know? <laughs> okay. I should be taking this in probably a slightly more methodical fashion. Yeah, this is not what I guess I would call a methodical fashion. Um, maybe there's some POIs down here, or maybe there's nothing, and then I'm just clearing out the map for, you know, nothing. Oh my god. Oh, truly. Okay, well, at least we'll get some berries. I mean, you may recall that was, that was what made yesterday, or today, I guess. Uh, yeah, yesterday. So productive. And by so, I mean just the most productive day we had so far. Um, just not saying much, actually. Okay, perfect. So now we're here, and I'm, I'm like totally sure we use that, uh, we use the fertilizer scroll. So I'm pretty offended about like the current situation of us not having anything fertilized, like nothing combined when they're all the same type of crop. That's, I'm completely robbed is what I'm saying. Okay, let's combine these little guys. Let's combine you guys too. No, no, we will not be combining you guys. Exciting, exciting. Okay, I'm out of water, which is bad. Cool. Hello, friends. Thank you. I mean, at least we're getting some money. Okay, wow. Okay, we dodged that one. Thank goodness. Okay, you, this, this whole sharp shot business, like, I'm not here for that. Okay. It is nice that the killing enemies uh, works on energizing you. I mean, that is actually pretty cool. But you don't have very long before you, you lose your energizing progress. Um, I thought they were that way. Oh god, I've clicked out of the screen. Okay, I'm still alive. I haven't even taken damage. Oh my god. Apparently I should just tab out of this game instead of playing it. And we would be doing so much better. Uh, that's great news, I guess. Um, I, I guess it at least makes things easier for me. <laughs> maybe, <laughs> maybe not the most promising news for me though okay i like how nothing's ready okay ju just you down here little guy great great work okay but we need more fertilizer that's for sure um yeah sure i'll harvest you it's fine Whew. okay i need to do something to prevent myself from like dragging these screens all around apparently i just i cannot be trusted at all um i guess it's not a huge surprise i was like oh you're giving away a chicken uh, energize all friends. When you become energized, honestly, that seems great. Uh, there's no way I'm doing that, though. Okay, um... Hmm. Hmm. Like, I don't love a blunder bloom. 
and we'll be stuck with it. But it's gotta be better than what we've got now, right? But we can't we can't afford a biodegrader. Oh, we don't even have enough for this either. I like how I'm over here acting like there's a real choice. Um, planes, garden beds. I mean, we can do that, but then there's no way we can afford a gun next time. So we shouldn't. We should just leave it be. We already have, you know, a full field of crops that we can't take care of. So no, no point in spending our time on that. Um, I'll just go ahead. Are these planes? These are the cactus ones, right? Oh, God. I'm not even good at keeping track of these little guys, unfortunately. Okay. Cool. Oh, they've become corn. Okay, desert garden beds. That's excellent. That's really nice. Uh, we don't have any space for them, so it's less nice, I guess. Whatever. We'll come back to it in a bit. Are these all ready? No. And they're like partially combined? Okay, this is terrible. I'll just go north and not think about this. Okay, we'll take you. Okay, you guys stop it. Please. Horrible. Okay, I need to stop letting myself get so distracted by, um... Okay, what? Okay, I see. I see. I need to stop letting myself get distracted by, like, farming during the day. Like, it, it is easier to farm them because, oh my god, please leave me alone. Um, it's easier to farm them, right? Because you're, like, not being attacked and you don't have to worry as much about the whole hold left click, hold right click, pay attention to the things going on around you situation, right? When did we kill all these guys? Like, that's weird, right? Did somebody else come through here and wipe them out? <laughs> oh my god, yes, finally a cow. Uh, we need it. It's like, I'd say it's a win condition, but I think at this point, yeah, only loss conditions exist. Um, okay, it's not too much of an issue there. Um, I mean, losing is, is very simple. <laughs> I can make that happen anytime. So, okay, nice. What do they have? Apple trees? Okay, and remember not to be confused with the difference between apples and peaches. Which is pretty wild, right? Because, like, I, um... I mean, there's no comparison, okay? Like, I, I don't... I, look, if there are people who think that apples and peaches can go, like, you know, toe-to-toe -to -toe with each other... Like, I, I don't know. Like, clearly I, I'm missing the gene for appreciating apples if that's the case. But, I mean, like, apples are just, like, that fruit that you're not that, like, excited to have. You know what I mean? It's like, oh, yeah, apples. Okay. You know, and I mean, it doesn't help probably that there are so many varieties and that like, you know, it doesn't seem like it's particularly, um, like, I guess consistent, you know, like, look, green apples. Okay. Can I do this? Yes. Yes. Very nice. Did I lose? No, that's just a flower. Okay. Okay. This isn't great. If he takes my cow, um, oh God. Okay. Try not to get hit by that. Try not to get hit by that. It's just like, I need the time for the spin up on this one. Okay, cool. Um, and by cool, I mean like it's not super cool. No, it's not super cool. I'm just gonna have to ignore my crops and hope that like everything goes, oh my God, give me my pig back. See, this was bound to happen, but I'm just gonna try to empty this clip. Okay, we did and we only took the one damage, which is really actually better than I think I was expecting. And I mean, it was our own fault for deciding to try to save the, uh, oh God, get out of there. We're trying to save the pig. You know, what, what? Okay, that's crap. But let's all calm down because no matter what, we're gonna be just fine. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, I'm good, right? Yes. I mean, except for the fact that I think they just like, I have no animals. I have no animals, none. Okay. Uh, well, the boss is dead. Uh, that, that's, that's what I can say about that. Wow. Okay. Um, that's like not super good. Okay, we have enough of this that this is good. I hope I didn't pass up. I hope I just passed up like a watering thing earlier and then I didn't pass up like the whole, please, please do the four square ones, obviously. That's clearly what I'm looking for. Okay, let's go ahead and harvest everything. Okay. Ugh. A little slow there, sorry. Okay. Well, we should obviously just go ahead and plant the, <sighs> crap. Well, I mean, I wanna, I want to. Let's just, let's put down some verses, okay? Let's put down a four square verses because we can and because such an important part of Harvest Moon is getting married. Um, oh, cool. Well, we're energized, which is nice. I guess we can stand by these little guys and, you know, hope they hurry up and grow. Hello, friends. 
Okay, you as well. Okay, and then we'll just, I guess, stand here while I look for other things I want to, like, actually plant. Oof, okay. So we've survived through summer, which is incredible. Truly, absolutely incredible. This is, this is my first time making Oh, we can't afford either of these guns. Not even a significantly better Catling gun. It hurts, it hurts. Oh, no! And track pants? Oh, I see. We are being punished. Okay, well, this time we got max full, which, like, thank God. Um, I'm really hoping when we, when we make it back, uh, <laughs> cool. Okay, we got lots of heartbeat seeds. Don't have any fertilizer, though. I mean, a bee would be nice, but of course we can't afford it. Can't afford anything that we'd like to. She's a radish, right? Isn't that what the mayor is? I mean, she's, like, pink. Um, yeah. Hmm, 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 suffering. Yeah, we're really, really leaning into the suffering thing. I mean, that's nice, but again, I'm really trying to get a gun. I think we could do it today, okay? I really do. I think that we could do enough, uh, enough damage, is what I was gonna say. <laughs> Which is not quite right, but, um, okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna start, you know, I'm gonna put the heartbeat four square down. And we can almost afford it now, the fertilizer from the thing. It's not quite ready. But it's okay. Okay, we get that one done. We harvest a little bit. You know, and then, oh, what I was hoping for is that I was hoping they would bring our farm animals back. Because if you look all around the edge of your farm, they might have brought them back, right? Isn't that a thing that can happen? Please? Yeah, look, here's one. Please be the cow. It's a pig. Oh, okay. Oh, Jesus. Hey, don't do that. Um, okay, let's just make a quick circuit of the farm. Please, 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 please. Did, seriously, we only got the pig back? Is that, is that like for real? Oh, man. That's not good, huh? Okay, well, we'll deal with that little guy when we get back. We only have a minute of daylight now, which really sucks. That's okay. Um, I mean, definitely like if you want incredible games, you exclusively have to play time, which we haven't unlocked yet. I don't even know what it takes to unlock her. Probably like not being uh, an incredible failure at this game. I imagine that's like one of the things that they want from you. Okay, let's see what we got. Okay, weed stump, that's actually pretty great. Uh, if we make weeds harvestable, you know, where we'd get some money from them? Or yeah, that's vinaigrette, right? I think then we would be in business. Okay, look, you, you gotta stop, okay? You're, like, clearly just a nuisance. Um, okay. Always energized at low health. I guess we should... I'm gonna take cattle tumor turrets just because... Just because I really want another cow. And this is just... This is wishful thinking in practice, you know? What is this? Oh, that's just the worm. Yeah, yeah, the worm wants to talk to us. I know, I know. We have ten seconds. That's not very much time. But what if... You know, what if this, this is what we were looking for all along, you know? Oh good, we've already attracted the attention of those cats, and now we're at one health. Okay, cool, let's immediately go back to the farm. Oh my god, what are you doing? Go away! Oh yeah, weed stump. Okay, let's hurry up with this bad boy. Let's get it watered, and let's stand on it. Ah, uh, they merge without a fertilizer? I mean, we've got to do that. Merge without a fertilizer seems pretty important. Oh, I'm not looking forward to this. I need to stand near the heartbeat, ideally. I mean, it needs to get watered, and also I need to make it grow faster, but you have to stop. So, whatever it is we need to do to make this happen. And, you know, weed stump will actually be super useful for us when we get to the point where... Oh my god, please, water the heartbeat. We're all going to die here. Um, very important you know, for these, like, as we progress into the second half of the year and, like, we start getting this, this really weird old... What the hell is shooting in that weird pattern? Um, clearly it's dangerous. Oh, we got two of these guys. Okay, don't, don't eat my crops, it's rude. Okay, great. So now we're back to full health. Uh, I like the, the continuous seesaw there. Yeah, we obviously need to get... Oh my gosh, okay, maybe I should not be shooting if it's gonna be so slow. We need to get another planes one down. These are planes ones, right? Why, why can't I put that down? What was the issue there? Um, okay, you should die. 
I mean, that's certainly one issue I'm having. Okay, what, what's the problem here? One, two, why, why, why doesn't this go? Is it because of the rose? Because if, like, if it's just, if it's just a matter of, like, I've planted everything in, like, a really inefficient way, I mean, that's just, like, that's, like, such a terrible thing uh, for me to have to live with right now. Like, oh, God, see, it's, it's dawn already. Oh, we're so hosed. I mean, like, no progress on this. Okay. Let's go ahead and combine these. I mean, it, like, just when we were starting to get ahead with the cow, too, you know? But then we, we just kind of crapped out, you know? I mean, look at this. We'll never, we'll never see another gun again. Oh, wow, bees water crops. I mean, I'd love it if I had a bee. Uh, yeah, I mean, like, to get to this point, to get to, like, day two of fall and just not even have, I mean, bees water crops would be great with this, but I can't even afford a hummingbird. Oh, man. Um, hummingbirds are, like, crazy. Um, there was this whole, okay, cool. Oh, we got a little bit of extra time in our day. That's great, since, you know, you know I like to waste it. Um, I don't even know. I guess we'll just do this real quick. I want that one bed to, to, to happen, but I think I have to, like, get rid of this guy, or... I don't know. I guess now just these two, right? Okay, whatever. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna leave that there. I'm gonna collect these. Okay, look, we're technically still in dawn, which is really good for us. Um, I need to get these, like, harvested, though, as soon as possible, since I'm doing really dumb things here. Oh, wait, maybe I can just throw this down right here. And it says me off to expand the tree leftward. But I say it like, you know, like there's any real hope that we're, like, getting this stuff. Oh, God, I put the cactus bed down there. Oh, my goodness. Well, see, this is what I'm talking about. Um, you, please die. Okay, and then we put this down right here for the plains bed so that they're planted next to each other and they get a fertilizer benefit, question mark? I have no idea what any of that means. Let's go. Okay, at least we're still getting, like, a full day in. Oh, my God, something else is returned. Please be the cow. Please be the cow. Okay, we got a pig and a chicken back. Okay, we got something else. Maybe a cow. Maybe a cow. Oh, my God. I didn't think... I, they said it couldn't be done. That's incredible. I really did not think we would get anything back after the first day. I thought that that was, that was your, your time. Okay, I'm looking around. Okay, there are more animals. There's got to be a pig, right? No? We had we had three chickens? Is that is that true? Okay, whatever. Um, yeah, see, so these, these weeds, these old weeds that turn into these awful, like, nightmarish creatures that uh, routinely uh, kind of sneak up on you. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not trying to live that life. Okay. So let's get to the jungle, because now we only have a minute. Again, not great. But, I mean, a great get. I, I think it was probably actually worth it to spend the 45 seconds, because, I mean, if we could spend 45 seconds here and get that many animals, then it would be worth it, right? So. Okay, I can't see where it's going to go, but certainly not up here. But I'm just going to go ahead and try to get this cat out of the way, out of the bag. Okay, uh, I can't do that at all. Excellent work, excellent work. But yeah, um, this is probably going to be a, a pretty boring harvest moon. I mean, if this were like a, a wonderful life, right, we would just die, right? Don't you just end your year if you don't, uh... Well, that, that's useless. Okay, well, three turrets. I mean, this could, this could be a lifesaver, right? Please, beetles, leave me alone. Um, it's really kind of, kind of a shame, um, because it's, it's pretty clear to me that, um... Uh, we are plagued by insects this run. They're all not our friend. Like, the roaches are a problem. These beetles are clearly dangerous. Oh my god, it's dusk already. There's somehow a cat after us. That's not a bug, I guess, but, you know, close enough. Oh god, where is it? I mean, I appreciate its commitment to killing me, but, um, I need to get back to my farm. Okay, they drop random seeds. I mean, I don't really want three desert garden beds. This is fine. Okay, please leave me alone, as I desperately struggle to. So there's like a hole around here? Yeah! Heck yeah. Okay, cool. I guess I accidentally used one of the birds. That's awesome. Um, I say that's awesome, and I guess I'm being sarcastic, but it really wasn't the end of the world, I suppose. You, you're hiding in my crops. Not cool. Okay, so maybe let's get just as much stuff down as we can. It'd be cool to get another set of roses down. We could, you know, I don't know, do something with that later. Please kill this guy before he does something crazy. Nope, that's not for me, huh? You as well, I suppose. 
I mean, they've got to be cherry bombs, right? But, like, cherries have such pronounced stems, and that doesn't. That looks like an apple. And what have I told you about apples? You know, not that impressive. But really, like, peaches, you know? Like, peaches are, like, the actual embodiment of, like, summer, you know? And, like, I'm not crazy about summer. Um, I think it's probably not my favorite season. But at the same time, like, it's hard to be, like, a fruit that literally tastes like a season is not an incredible fruit, you know? <laughs> like, it's, it's pretty good, I think. So, okay, well, we're very energized. Um, maybe I could use that energy for something? Like, planting a plane's bed. Oh, God. We're getting killed. I mean, that, too. I could also use it for that. Here's a plane's bed we could plant. And a cherry bomb we could kill. Okay, great work. And then I guess what I plan, I guess I could just plant some of these up here. And get them done. Cool. Oh, the cactus ones aren't merging without a, a thing, and that makes sense. That makes sense. I can live with this. Okay, do we have some tree seeds? I thought we did. Maybe not? Well. Okay. Yeah, I definitely don't have things growing in a way that's, like, super good. Yeah, I mean, like, look, there's, like, all these weird holes all over everything. Uh, not an ideal situation. Like, I remember, um, definitely in Harvest Moon. Oh, we can afford the leech. We might have to take it. Turrets and drones fire faster. Oh, we have, we have three, three turrets, so that's probably worth something. I'm not that interested in that. Cow house? Oh my god, yes, with the turrets, and then we have the turrets fire faster. Really, it's quite sick. Okay, we'll try the leech. The leech gun is really fun. Um, I don't know that it's very... We'll create a mole hole when we're out of ammo, which is cool. I was hoping for the multi-leech mod, but... It, it's not that day, apparently. I don't know where this should go. I don't know. I guess we should throw this one down here, right? And then we need to just, like, kind of generally make room for this one. Okay, you can go. And then here. And then I guess we could put, like, a turret up here. And maybe a turret. Oh my god, over here? What are you doing? Okay. And then a turret over. Okay, we got that turret there. Okay, so maybe that was all good. Jungle seeds in a line. Ugh. I mean, I guess, honestly. Desert crops grown in a desert garden bed merge out of fertilizer. Merge, merge out of fertilizer. Sure, seems good. Okay, are we out of plain seeds or something? Or do the pigs just normally do this work for me and I can't tell? I'm guessing that one, honestly. Okay. And then let's go ahead and put this this out here. Okay, so we just have a peach tree here and a date tree here. So, oh my god, why was I pursuing that one so hard? Did you see me want to die there? Okay, so let's kill that one. Okay, I need to be I need to be doing other things. Okay, we'll come back later. Much later. Some other day. Why why are the chili seeds all sparkly? Are we at like max rank with jungle plants? Because that wouldn't make any sense. Okay. Please. And then I mean, knowing that when we run out of ammo, uh, I'm imagine I'm doing air quotes, but like I'm not doing air quotes because I'm not trying to die on this game quite yet. Um but you know, when we run out of ammo with the leech, then we would have to go back and do more like yard work or whatever. Farm work? You know, you get it. Okay, yeah, that's right. We did kind of a weird diagonal situation. Oh my god, there's a cat somewhere. Cat, you were the worst. Okay. I mean, in real life, I like cats, okay, but in this game, I think they're basically horrible. We'll take this turret because, I mean, it seems nice to have these turrets and they fire faster and I don't know, maybe it'll help me stay alive, you know? Don't accidentally hit the beetle, whatever you do. Don't hit the beetle. Don't hit the beetle. Just keep attacking the tree guardian and don't hit the beetle. Okay, a current. That's actually pretty good. For our current situation. Two bananas. It's kind of a shame we didn't run out of ammo, honestly, because then we'd, we'd get a, a quick teleport back. And I guess I'm going the wrong way for it, but... This way, right? We're, we're, we're close? We're not close, huh? Come on, come on, come on. Oh, man, they caught me first. Okay, honestly, this gun might help me with old McDonald, though. Okay, he's always in the middle, right? So this has got to be it. 
Oh, this is not helping him at all. Or not helping me. You know what I'm saying. Okay, a current. Let's just put it down somewhere. Let's put this current. Current. My my dear my dear current friend. Okay, finally. Okay, we're too far. Okay, he's already gone again. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I do think the music's like a complete bop though. Um, cool. Yeah, and like, kind of the lack of pushback as well. Like, I'm not pushing anybody back, and I, I got hit. Um, cool. I can't see anything around here. I mean, like, look at this. This isn't killing anybody. Okay. Maybe I should have gotten another pig. Okay, let's be better. Okay, okay, cool. I mean, I, I was a little bit better. Okay, woo, let's be careful with that one. Um, yeah, I've got to stay really close to him to actually do any damage with this leech gun, though, huh? I mean, like, I've basically got to just sit on top of him, I guess. Um, it doesn't really seem like a very safe, safe idea, though. I mean, he's gonna go this way, right? Okay, trying to get distracted. But I mean, like, I'm not gonna kill him before morning. Like, there's, like, no way. I'm, I'm gonna spend my time sitting here, like, trying to kill a leech for, like, 30 minutes. Okay, I mean, at least we're keeping the leech gun pretty charged up. And I kind of remember the fact, like, I'm not buying a new gun every time, you know? So, like, if I didn't like this, I guess we were just going to be kind of hosed. In fact, I'm not sure I like it. So, that really? Because I went out of my way to avoid that one. Okay, let's just go get our revenge. Cool, that guy's dead. Are we seriously going to just barely not kill him now? Where is he? Okay, he's dead. He's dead. Awesome. All right, all right. I mean, this could have been worse. We basically got nothing out of the day. So that part wasn't really very good. Oh yeah, I forgot I was supposed to do those this way. Okay, well, whatever. We can go ahead and plant them here. Okay. Okay, not bad, not bad. Um, okay. Well, we can't afford a magic leech. I mean, that's clearly a magic leech. Uh, a rake is pretty good. Maybe we'll come back and marry him in a bit. I mean, obviously not right now, but sometime. Okay, well fed. That was better than full, which is what we got last time, right? Or the last time that we didn't do great. At least we don't have a polygamy or anything. Okay, a bee. This is our first bee. That's very exciting. Um, and I might use this scroll when we get back. I think that's probably like the best idea. We're not in desperate need of heartbeats. Where are what? Okay, we have 12 heartbeat seeds. And we have a lot of fertilizers. We should actually probably grow, go ahead and grow one. Grow ahead and go one. Um, cool. We don't really have any more date seeds, so. Okay, let's try to be like pretty efficient when we come back and not accidentally waste like the entire day here, you know? I say as I prepare to spend the entire day here on accident. Okay, all this going. Cool. And then, oh yeah, we were doing the these little guys. Okay. And then we'll just go ahead and merge them all. And Oh, and then because they're planted together, they got like some kind of boost or something, which is cool. Yeah. And then we don't have like, I'm not necessarily growing them in a way that makes like a ton of sense here, but hey, we've got like resilience, so we get some benefit from it at least. It's not like it's just a complete waste. Um, okay. We should probably put this turret down somewhere. Sure. We'll put it here, I guess. And then... I don't know, I want to plant these trees, but we don't have any space. Um, I do have 12, 12 of these things, maybe we should just go ahead and make some space to plant these trees. Um, yeah, we'll do that. Okay, we can plant two of the trees directly, just like this. Um, and then I don't know, banana trees maybe? What do you think? Well, where are we at? We killed this one and we didn't finish the jungle yet, so I guess we should go there finish up the jungle if we have any extra time then we'll go and buy a bridge to the fancy jungle that hurts more yeah for sure um okay i definitely feel like we probably are not prepared to switch between biomes like this like i mean like, there's such like completely different diseases in the tropics versus like other places and i mean like tundras can have pretty unique diseases too obviously nothing compares to um Oh, we'll take the stats up. I know, I know, I know. We probably shouldn't hit these, but... I mean, it's not like we... Like, we can take care of all of the weeds right away, so... Okay. The berries saved us before. Hopefully, we're not to a point where a handful of berries 
will be like the thing that saves us, but like if they are, like I'm, you're not gonna catch me complaining about them, you know? We have 15 seconds. That's not great, but let's just fix this bridge. We'll know where we're going next time. We'll plant the banana trees. Oh, wow. Dangerous. But yeah, so we'll plant those banana trees for next time. I'm gonna leave that for next time too. This mushroom. Oh god, there's one of those horrible cats. Okay, well we're clearly not gonna kill it this time. Nope, there it goes. Oh, wow. Terrible cat, please. Just die. Oh, it's a, it's a calm moon. I mean, that's actually great. We really, we really did kind of need something like that. So let's head back to the farm where we will proceed to hopefully not be punished. <laughs> cool. Cool, cool. We can combine these guys, which is super weird. Look at that. You can like even see how they're the, the not regular plants. You heard me. That they're the resilience plants. Okay, everybody's got in a fertilizer. Okay, okay. This is truly not that bad. All garden beds till moist soil, I and mean, that's that's pretty fun. Let's take that. Okay, we'll take extra fertilizer. I know we're like doing good on it right now, but that doesn't mean we're gonna be doing good on it forever. Honestly, I want to clear out a bunch of these weeds. I mean, if I do, we'll probably get vinaigrette next time, but that's okay. That's okay. But yeah, um, so of course, you know, I, I get that like the gameplay style itself is more like bullet hell and less like Harvest Moon, but I feel like I enjoy it particularly because I really like the Harvest Moon games. And so I'm super excited for the remake that they're doing of, is there a desert? Are these all desert ones? God, this tree is in the way. Okay, well that's fine. We have plenty of those things that I'm thinking of in my mind. So. Let's go ahead and do this, and then we can put down the desert bed. And that's supposed to help them or something. Okay, I didn't want to do this. Like, I wanted to wait until we got a four square of sunflower seeds, but like, if we're not going to, and we have this much fertilizer, let's just put these in a row and give them all the fertilizer. Yeah, okay, perfect. Finally, maybe we'll be doing okay. Let's take that. Okay, we only have one more wave, unfortunately. Let's put the scarecrow down somewhere. Maybe like, I don't know, up here. Okay. Um, we should throw down some more of these weird arctic uh, seeds. Let's just see if we can hurry up and kill the soil. That'd be really nice. Oh, that's fun. The scarecrow killed it, confusingly enough. Okay. Okay. And these seeds and these. Okay. And then we just go ahead and combine them all. They're all getting a little fertilizer boost, right? Okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. It was a pretty productive night, I think. I mean, more so than most nights, I suppose. Okay. So we got a squirrel gun which would kill us and we can't afford it. Man, imagine being priced out of the squirrel gun. You know, that's painful. Hmm. Well, I mean, we should just, we should be thankful that we got our trees back, you know? Um, my, our animals back. Although, I mean, I'm happy about the trees too. Apple saplings. These are apples. We already have one apple. Do we have an apple tree planted yet or not? No. Hey, let's control ourselves, okay? We don't need an, a mega apple tree nearly as much as we need a better gun at some point in the future. So we should remember that and not, not jeopardize that, that dream. Okay. Here's a banana tree. You're doing great. Here's a banana tree. Those are peaches. These are dates. I can do this. I mean, I like how I'm like, oh, let's make sure we remember where we planted these. And then I proceed to like have no recollection of where any of the stuff was planted. Uh, sure, you two can go there too. Whoa, hey, don't kill me. Okay, we can collect you. And then, like, why not just go ahead and throw down some rows of crops? I think that's fine. Like, no, it's not incredible, but we'll be able to do a four square there and here. And that's pretty good. Okay, let's go. We'll go ahead and we'll get more jungle seeds out of this, which will be useful. Hopefully we'll also get some more banana seeds. And oh my god, I need to go back and just go talk to the gopher. Hello. Okie dokie. All right. Oh no, another horrible cat. Man, this whole running to the left thing has not turned out to be as safe as I clearly was hoping it would be. Okay, we got two of those awful cats on us. 
And we don't seem to be capable of killing any of them. Oh my god. Okay, we finally took damage. Which, I mean, at this point... Oh, wow. Okay, so the leech... The leech gun, unfortunately, does make you start a lot of... Uh, start a lot of fights perhaps you weren't trying to at the time. Wow. Let's hit the cat, please. Nope. Again. Again with the cat. Okay, we got hit again. I mean, at least we still have plenty of heartbeat seeds. That, that just barely counted. That's so rude. Look, it, like, it never stops. The whole cat situation. Where is it now? Like, it should, we should be able to see it. Because we've just, like, it stopped spawning in. It's not attacking us anymore. Maybe it went home. Okay. Well, I'm glad that this jungle adventure has basically cost us everything. Whew. Okay. Well, when we get back, we can grow, uh, Jesus. We can grow a heartbeat and everything should be fine. I hope. Please, chameleon. I know you are a fellow chameleon, but I can't live like this. No, no, really? It like, it stops? I mean, maybe I guess it was just, you know, no longer visible, but... Okay, let's get back. Let's kill the cat. Okay, that way we don't have to kill the cat later. And then let's see about getting back. Where am I at? Okay, yeah, I'm almost there. Okay, that's not bad. Whew. Okay, you guys are pretty bad, though. I think one of them was taking the bridge away. I mean, like, which is great. You know, for sure, go go away. I think that's great. Okay, cool. We're immediately now, we're out of, um... Thank God we had things ready. Because we're uh, immediately out of ammo for the leech gun as soon as we got back. Very inconvenient timing. Wow. This leech is, like, not very hungry, huh? Um, yeah, clearly it's not a professional leech, you know? Like, medical leeches, I imagine, have, like, a whole code of conduct, you know? They're, like, food critics, you know? Probably have, like, a limit to how much they can eat and, you know, really try to temper themselves. But clearly, these guys don't waste any time uh, trying to be professionals. Okay. I like how long it takes to kill even these guys. Like, the little... The little... Oh, God. Okay. So we have only one health left. So let's just stay away from everybody now. Stay away from everybody. I mean, I can't even kill this guy. Okay, wow. Well, we made it through the night. Uh, horrifically. I mean, what, what, a, what a bad night. But okay. We got that going. It should keep us alive for a bit. Harvest all these fellas. Whew! That's pretty wild, I'll be honest with you. Okay, we had a pretty successful day, though. We still can't marry Watercress. Sorry, Watercress, I keep forgetting to plant the uh, roses. But, but after that, I swear. Okay. Tundra seeds? I don't really care about those. Hmm. Do we need more banana trees? No. This is an apple one. I don't think we've actually planted any apple seeds yet, so, okay. Not super useful. Let's throw down the roses, for sure. Um, before we head out. I mean, honestly, I should probably wait until the... the harpy is ready. So that just means I should do useful things in the meantime. So let's do that. Let's stay by this one. I actually should have let the cow do that if possible, because they are... they are better than us. You know what I mean. Um... They're faster at watering than you are, I think, is, is a thing. I feel like I've read it somewhere. Oh my god! Oh my god, we almost died there! Oh god! Terrifying! Like, it just it just reached the end of its, its like, living time, and it just stopped. The bullet there that almost killed us. Very fortunate. Oh, okay, we're almost out of... Okay, whew! Great. Yeah, I would definitely love to stop having the leech gun at this point. Um, I think it's terrible now. I mean, like, I don't think it's terrible, holistically. But right now, it certainly hurts. Um, okay. And then we're running out of seeds on, like, the self-growing crop, which is not good. So, we, wow, wow, please. Don't hit me, okay. Cool. And then I can just go ahead and, I'm just gonna plant these. I know it's, like, not great but I just want something out here. Okay, okay, let's go. We'll take the gopher back. We'll finish exploring in this cursed region. And then 
move on. Okay, we need to go right and down. And I don't think I collected everything from like all the fights that I started either, which is not good. Um, I thought I killed that guy? He, he not dead? Oh god, it hit the beetles! Ah, <sighs> jeez. I don't know. I'd like more fighting stat, but that is gonna hurt. For sure. Okay, let's kill this guy. I like how you can run into the rabbits and they don't hurt you, but I always forget which enemies that's true for and which it's not, so I just try to avoid hitting them, and then when I do run into them, I'm like, oh, yeah, of course, I, I knew about that, and it was a very, like, conscious choice. Chameleon, please. There's no time for your shenanigans. Okay, so now we're fast, which is good. Ooh, oh god, there's a cat. Okay, there's the cat. We're probably not capable of killing it very quickly. Man, and we sacrificed so much for that fighting stat, but what have we gotten in return, you know? Clearly nothing I'd be that excited with. Okay, uh... I don't know, I guess a hog? Yeah, that's probably better. Oh god, we're gonna have the cat after us. Yeah, thank you, Itsy Bitsy Spider, for saving us. Okay, uh, wish you weren't here. Wish you would die a little faster. Wish you wouldn't take my health. Those are all things that I, I think. Okay, let's go ahead and put this down. Um, um, hmm, hmm. Perhaps not worth it. Uh, alright. Wow, what the hell is going on? There are so many dots. Okay, let's put this here. Okay, itsy bitsy, please. I it's a beautiful web, but uh, I like how and I, I just I'm trying to kill it, but like I'm not close enough. But getting closer to the wave just seems kind of like suicide. Okay, uh, itsy bitsy's back over there, but they're eating all my crops. Hmm, a slight problem, sure. Okay, come back here, itsy bitsy. Oh my god, spiders, you know, can't live with them. Can't live without them. Okay, that's terrible. We can't afford to take any damage now. Oh, God! Oh, God! Well, we died at the end of winter. So we almost made it to a win on this one. Painful, painful, but we're close. This next one, this will be the win. Oof, these are brutal, though. And I think that's, like, a good thing. I don't know. I think uh, I've, like, mixed up you know, fun and suffering in video games a little bit. So I think like for me, I'm like, oh yeah, this is, this is really grueling. Therefore it must be really fun. But yeah, anyway, I think I was rambling about, um, A Wonderful Life earlier and, um, they're doing like a full like update and remake kind of thing with it. Um, that's coming out this summer and I'm like, I'm quite excited for it. Um, I think the modernization will be fun. I did see like a, a pretty hilarious complaint online um, that talked about, so if, if you've played it, you may recall Mucka Mucka, which was this, I, I assume that's how you pronounce it, I have no idea, it's M-U-K-A. Um, this like, it's basically a yeti, right? It's like a strange furry beast. Um, and someone was complaining online that like the remake makes it, makes it scary. And I'm like, no, like the, the creature is bigger than you, you know, even in the game and it, it doesn't speak and, and it likes to like eat, like you can give it food and like that's what it likes. Like clearly the thing is considered eating you for sure, you know, like you're lucky that it hasn't, but like I don't get the impression that that thing is not scary, um, like cerebrally at least. So I think the rework is completely fine. I think it's okay if we acknowledge that the Yeti is maybe a little frightening. Okay, well, we didn't take damage there. I, I can't, I look forward to taking damage elsewhere, but not there, at least. Completely offensive the way the scorpions will just hide there. I mean, like, don't be a coward, little scorpion. Yeah, so I think that's really fun. Um, I guess they've also done, like, a remake for, um, not, um, for Friends of Mineral Town as well. And they kind of like, you know, change up the art style too, so it's a little bit more like the, the little like fat GB versions for the 3D models, instead of like the top-down 2D stuff. But I mean, it, the original game was for the Game Boy Advance, so I mean, that's kind of... I don't think they had a ton of processing power, so I'm trying to say. But, um... Yeah, so I think those will be like... I'm interested in playing both of those at some point, because... I don't know, kind of grew up on those farming sims, you know? 
Um, yeah, okay. We can do this. We'll kill this camp, and then we'll take the life-changing relic that will be inside. Life-changing. Do you hear? And then it's gonna be great. Okay, pocket squirrel and succulent weeds. Uh, we'll take pocket squirrel. I mean, it should give us, um, and potentially additional damage, but mostly... It says we're basically standing on one. Okay, we were. Okay, excellent, excellent. I guess succulent weeds is like more immediately useful. But what if pocket squirrel gives us, you know, that which we have always longed for, which is more and more unique seed? I'm pretty sure that's what we were, like that was, that was on, um, it's always been on my Christmas wish lists, you know, ever since I was a kid, you know? We go to the mall and like ask Santa for presents and I would just be like more, uh, more and more rare seeds. Okay. Ooh, we got this going on. You know, we can actually, um, let's combine you guys, for sure. Okay. And then we can clear this area out, too. Okay. Go away, please. Perfect. Pocket squirrel approved. And then we can go ahead and put these pricklies down, and then maybe... Oh! Okay, well, I mean, we had to lose our first health somewhere. At least it was somewhere pointless, you know? Okay, so we do have a new wave coming in. Not great. Okay, let's put this turret down, I guess, just like right here. I don't know. It's better than nothing. Oh, we were at the end of the wave. I'm a fool. It's nice to learn that early, though. Okay, and then, yeah, we just need more fertilizer, and then we can combine those guys. I mean, 36 is still not great, but given that we have some other things planted. I mean, I said, like, just for once we could find the berries on the first day. Um, no matter where we go. Don't look. Just don't even look, okay? Like, you don't need to know that cows could block bullets. There's just no point. It's only going to hurt me. Um, okay. Well, let's get out of here. I know those are ready to go, but it'd be best if we could get some fertilizer for them, combine them so they'd be more valuable, and hopefully... It would solve all life's problems. I assume it will. Okay. So we have this going on. Um, cool. It would be so awesome. Like, anytime my aim is bad in this game, like, I'm just like, oh, God, is are like, my terrible Apex Legends skills, like, rubbing off onto my Atomicrops playing? Because I, I fervently hope that that is not the case. I mean, if Apex Legends can actively make me worse at other things in my life, I don't know. I don't know. That's going to be a lot to have to soak in, you know? Okay, you guys need to go away. Yeah, we should definitely get the tree guardian today. I mean, we should clear out the desert today. I think that's that's pretty clear. Wait, I'm just using the word clear a bunch. And, and not even, like, effectively in, like, a pun kind of situation. I do feel like I'm really getting a lot of bang for my buck out of this pocket squirrel, though. We're getting a lot of pocket squirrel uses. I don't know what the percent chances on that, but it feels like it's like a lot. Okay, you have to die as well. Oh, cool, cool. Look at that. We would have just gotten, um, organic armor. But I mean, hey, you know, I should not complain. We're doing okay on life and stuff. I mean, we got three health and two heartbeat seeds. So that's truly not that bad. I hope I didn't miss anything. I clearly can't make any guarantees on that. I was looking for, it says I'm like right near a hole. Okay, I'm not allowed to take that one. Kind of offensive that it even shows up then. Very rude. Okay. It's nice that I can just walk through cactuses like that though. Oh, hey, there's another camp here. I was kind of hoping we would find another camp. So that's good news for me. Um, cool, cool. Please feel free to die at your leisure. Okay, awesome. Oh, we got a tree. I enjoy the trees. I mean, they're just crops that, um... Okay, and we'll just really not have enough to combine these. Okay. Cool. Well, we'll do that. We'll see if we can get a rose down uh, before they slaughter us. I think that'll be an interesting thing to see. I don't have a huge amount of faith. Okay. Uh, yeah, like I want to get, I want to get a tree down, right? But then we're not going to get anything out of, 
out of like that that crop area. So I guess I should just throw down the these guys, the desert seeds, so that we can get something out of them. Oh man, I should have kept that, but we did not get it. Okay, and I guess we can use our energized situation to um just cut weeds. I mean, oh no, we're already like not energized anymore. Jeez. Clearly, we have a very fast metabolism. There'd never be any point in drinking coffee, you know? It just, you get like a quick jolt of energy and that's it. Okay, we'll get some more fertilizer, which is actually great. I'm really, really hoping that the rose grows before morning, which I don't think it will. Certainly not if I just like run into things. Um, and we're not playing time, so it's not like we get penalized that way. But I mean, if we die, then we won't live to see morning. So, I think that... Okay, yes, 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 very good, very good. Beautiful. Okay, and then the fact that this guy grew does, I feel like, kind of validate the, the situation that we found ourselves in. Um, okay, Tundra Garden Bed, Jungle Seeds, and a line. I don't know. I wasn't super impressed with our last situation. Okay, so then we can go ahead and we could grow. Really, really, we're not gonna get the flower this morning. I'm gonna go ahead and put this down. I know we could put the tundra seed down, but I'm not doing it. Oh my god, no! No, I, I even pressed the harvest button. I pressed the harvest button, but we didn't get it. Oh god, and we could have gotten sweat banned. Wow. Oof. That's always this, this heart wrenching, huh? Butcher knife, not great, but we would get two additional mods. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I hate using it forever, though, because I feel like I will. And, I mean, we get the Catling Gun, and we... Oh, okay, we got a bonus mod, and that bonus mod was faster ramp up. That was, like, basically all we could have asked for. Oh, there you are mocking me. Okay. Let's hurry up and get this down. Please. And I'll just go ahead and I'll put down the... These desert plants, and then when we come back, maybe we'll just do the Tundra one. Like, we'll put down the Tundra bed. Maybe? Well, I don't have enough money to go to the tundra anyway, so we have to go to the plains. Whatever. That's fine. I look forward to getting more of those trees down, though. I mean, like, we're never getting those mega trees, and I really enjoy them. I just think they're, like, so cool, you know? And also, the fruits are worth a lot. Um, I do apologize for, for, you know, my previous serious tirade about uh, apple trees, though. Or apples in general, I mean... I don't know, but like I'm not a huge fan of like cider either. I feel like cider is fine, but I would prefer hot chocolate. So, take this bee. Yeah, okay. The bee is our only animal, so it'll just be out there speeding stuff up for us. I believe in it. I believe in it. Uh, wow, okay. That was good. Um, okay. Well, we'll take another turret. That's fine. This will be a dove thing, a coterie. I don't remember. I want to call it a cow house, but um, doves are not cows, so just in case you're all, uh, uncertain. Let's take blood rain. That seems helpful. Would it be cool to like ever see a cow? You know, like oh, wait, when when are we allowed to see cows? Just in the summer? Is that the deal? <laughs> they're uh, they're seasonal animals. I mean, some animals work that way, right? Like uh, toads and frogs, they're seasonal animals. I mean, right? Like they like hibernate, basically. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's considered hibernation or not. Because with reptiles, it's brumation. I don't know if perhaps um, the amphibians find themselves with a unique term as well. Wow, that was not what I was trying to do. I was trying to take the Cuba. I just wanted to like see where it was heading. Okay, I think it's just going to be to the right of us. So we should be able to just get it done. I would love that. Okay. I thought we would be... Oh, no! I was immediately swallowed up by the angry worm! And it, it really... I mean, unfriendly worm. Sorry. It seems quite unfriendly, though. Really living up to the name. Oh, dear. Okay. Cool. Let's maybe check on the crops. Everything going good over here? Not at all, huh? Cool. Where, where's the worm? Okay. Let's go ahead and accept that, you know, we might die there. Well, let's just... Waste a clip, okay. Great. I guess let's take out some of the these guys. Woo! 
Okay, okay, okay. So we took one damage, which really, truly, truly could have been just devastatingly worse. Okay, and then we can expand this upwards a little bit, which is good. Maybe we'll even get to see uh, energized status at some point. That would be incredible. Let's go ahead and put these down. Okay. Come on, you don't have to give me, like, enemies. I mean, I did such a good job killing the unfriendly worm at, like, by the halfway mark. I mean, why even punish me like this? Oh, we have another turret. I should put that down. We apparently, we love turrets in this house. Not bad, honestly. Okay. Oh, that needs watering. I accidentally put a turret down there. Oh, please stop. Oh, good. Another wave. Okay. I was not really trying to put beans down there, but that's cool. This will just be a nice little beans area for us. Cool beans is a phrase that people say. Oh, it's a really weird one. And I like that it's like a specific genre of person that utters the phrase cool beans as well. Like it's not quite just like soccer moms, but it is people with that, that coolness ratio. Okay, cool, we got this going on here. Um, I do kind of want to grow a four square of harvey's seeds. I don't have enough fertilizer, so maybe I should wait on it, but I'd like to. I think that would be a good situation to find ourselves in. Oh, Sriracha Soaker is great. Can't afford it. I mean, I don't think there's any point in looking at any of these things, but okay, the turrets and drones firing faster that Rue is selling, or I guess offering in exchange for her affection. Uh, anyway, ouch, what a devastating spring. <laughs> we, have no, we have no fighting stats and just good farming stats. Horrible. <laughs> Nice, nice. Okay. So yeah, we'll take that for sure. I appreciate that she rolls her eyes at our present, you know? And maybe even our presence. Okay, so I know we've got space potentially for this tundra bed. Uh, we, we don't actually have space for it? Oh, is there a weed there of some sort? Maybe, maybe, okay, whatever. I guess I'll put it down here. And then, I don't know. We have a four square space. So I feel like if we have that, we should actually probably use it. Um, I mean, in terms of pickaxes, you know, we could throw down a four square. I don't know exactly like a four square is a real thing besides like, you know, a failed app or whatever. Okay, whatever, we'll just put this third turret down here. I know it's a weird place to put the turret because I don't know, why would we, why would we do this? But. Let's get across the way. I actually need to like go and do a Tundra mission here, I think very soon, to be perfectly honest with you. But at least we can get the Tree Guardian situation figured out and maybe get something good out of it. Okay. Wow, that was much easier than I feel like it should have been with no fighting stat up, but okay. Uh, I mean, Flamingo Friend is okay. Certainly not the same caliber as like some of the other things we could have gotten. Like, um, Daily Orchard, da Atomic Orchid. I'll call it Daily Orchid, too, though. Did I, did I really take that damage there? That's such garbage. Sorry, Beeson. I should not have taken out my frustrations on you there. But yeah, I mean, one of the things that I think is, like, kind of wild. Um, so, I mean, like, in this game, you know, the, the trees will balk bullets. Which is not, that's not incredibly wild. I mean, it's a little bit wild because the rest of the crops don't do that, but you know, whatever. I'm not here to complain. Um, I'm mostly here to complain, but not about that. I draw the line somewhere, you know, I've got to. But, um, something that like kind of boggles my mind about trees in real life is like the way in which, gosh, I thought I could like dodge that. I could not dodge that. Oh God, I guess I'll take Harvest Moon. I know that lard is probably like something that would keep us alive, but um, apparently I, I, I just, I scoff at things keeping us alive. Like, <laughs> nothing could do that. Um, all right. You guys are all done. I should have definitely, well, whatever. Okay, we'll throw down, um, we'll throw down some roses. 
And I know that our health is not great, but I want more fertilizer before I commit to that. And I think that's not unreasonable. So let's get these roses down. Oh, that's right, they grow instantly. Okay, cool. So that was fast and easy. Um, okay. Honestly, we'll just throw some plains crops out there. Yeah, this is not what it looks like when you save your fertilizer, though. Oh, gosh. Maybe we'll, I don't know. Oh, we have a fertilizer scroll. We have a fertilizer scroll. Maybe that's going to change our life right now. Okay, let's go ahead and throw this down then. And then, oh, I wondered where all of my friends from this wave were. This does seem like a pretty quiet wave. Okay. Gosh. Um, all right. And then let's go ahead. We'll try to put this heart down. And then, of course, when it doesn't work, we'll just have to leave it on the ground and hope that no one eats it. Oh, good. And a uh, whole crew of people who eat that stuff have arrived. Okay, come on, let's get this down so that I can then use my fertilizer scroll. One, two, three, four. Okay, and then left shift. And then we get plenty of fertilizer. Yes, it combines them. That's great. Okay, and I think finally the heartbeat is satisfied, which is great. Okay, so we have two peach seeds. And I guess all we can really do here... Oh, let's water you. Yeah, Harvest Moon helped us get a lot of things grown. I mean, of course, getting the Flamingo Friend also really helped us get many things grown, but... Still, I want to recognize and honor the contributions of the Harvest Moon. Especially since I've been talking about that game franchise so much. Oh, pig wings is great. I have no pigs, though. Lard, though, gives us a chance to... Ooh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, Daylight Savings Time is great. I mean, it's not. I hate Daylight Savings Time, but the, uh... The little artifact there is pretty good. I mean, don't even get me started about Daylight Savings Time and how it's the worst. I mean, it has, like, you know, recorded... I, want, I always want to say negative health benefits. Like, if you can have a negative benefit. Um... But you know what I'm talking about, though. You know, you can have, um... Oh, gosh. Maybe I should get the trees down, but we don't have any pickaxes. Yeah, I don't know. This is a lot. Okay, cool. Whatever. Um, yeah, obviously you don't have negative benefits. That's what I have to say about that. Okay, you should die just so that I may live. Okay, perfect. I guess these guys are going to get the fertilizer. Okay, well, let's head... I was going to have us go to the Arctic, yes, because we put down one of those Arctic boxes. I was like, there's a particular one of these two that I thought we should go to. What's the map look like? Okay, I can't see it yet. Perfect, perfect. You don't want to know too much, you know? Never let your left hand know what your right hand's doing, right? Um, cool. It's always really funny when you meet people who actually, like, act like that in real life. And by that, I guess I'm just saying, like, extremely paranoid people. But they're really, they're a blast, you know? Certainly there's something unique. And I guess I suppose it also depends on, like, the context in which you know them, right? Because, like, it can be really hard to enjoy, like, terrible, eclectic uh, people when you, like, have to work with them. Um, you know, when things like you care about have to depend upon them, that's, that's not great, I'll be honest with you. Oh, well, there goes our organic armor. But let's be real, right? Like, are we truly, genuinely getting our money's worth if we don't get hit once a day? I mean, otherwise, then we're just completely, uh, we're completely wasting our organic armor, you know? And I, for one, I want to show my gratitude. So, I'll endeavor to get hit once per day. No more, no less, you know? I mean, too much of a good thing, right? Oh, God, I don't really want to fight them. I'm just going to pretend like they're not there. Uh, ignoring your problems is, like, the, the best solution, right? I always hear, hope is a valid strategy. That's the saying. Okay. But, yeah, like, the, the, the really weird thing about, like, real-life trees is how, like, they don't perhaps block bullets. Well, I guess also trees might do that. But what I was thinking was that they block rain. Because I think it's like the strangest thing. Like, you can actually go for a walk, and it can be raining. And if you're, like, walking in a relatively forested... Let's come back to this one tomorrow, so we can just take our organic armor. That's a much smarter way of doing things. Um, you know, you can actually, like, stay dry under them. Like, I don't know. It seems weird, right? Okay, we, we did take 
more damage than we were supposed to. We're supposed to take one, no more, no less, and we got a little carried away, I think. I can't believe I made it out of that without uh, taking serious damage. That one kind of wowed me. Apparently there is a hole nearby, but like I, I can tell how to get home from here, so we're just gonna buff it. And something's eating our crops? Oh dear. I hope I don't have anything important growing. I wanted to like start my wind up, but I can't see them. Okay, now we'll just start the wind up. Okay, so I think they ate, oh gosh, move, okay. I think they ate one of the little guys down here. Very sad, but that's okay. We can make you a new friend. I mean, it's, it's this kind of thought process that's like why people have multiple kids, right? Um, kidding. But um, as somebody who, like, I, I'm an only child, so uh, I think I, I have a, a little bit of a elitism for that. Anyway, oh god. Well, there goes that. Okay, remember, but tomorrow with a fresh start, we go back, we take a little bit of extra damage. And it's like, it's our whole plan. Like, it's it's what we want to see, because we'll get a fighting stat up. And right now we have zero fighting stat, so. Okay. Um, Planting seeds in a line, and placing desert garden beds. I mean, I'm not, like, thrilled about that. In fact, I'm not even going to place it, but whatever, it's fine. Okay, we definitely need to get some crops down, though, because we have, we have darkness on our side. Oh, no, it's dawn now. We no longer have darkness on our side. We have one more pickaxe, which means we can actually finally put things. You guys are all ready, right? No, only one of you is ready? Oh, I'm sorry. They are peas in a pod, literally, and I'm over here separating them from their friends. I love it when they're not fertilized, they're all grumpy, like they did not want to be awoken yet, except for this one, this one's like neutral, but then now they're all happy. Okay. Oh, rough. Okay, cool. I will marry her next time. She occasionally gives you pumpkin seeds. Yep. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> like I've got any like real option there. Anyway, um, cool. Okay, so let's get these done. We'll make a quick stop up north to get rid of our organic armor because we don't want stuff like that getting in our way, you know? Maybe I should actually put one of the trees down here. Well, but see, this should be, like, safe for a date tree then, right? Yeah, I mean, probably. Probably. Okay, let's just put this down. It'll be fine. We'll harvest this. We'll come back here. We don't have a pig, right? No, we have a cow and a bee. Okay. Okay, so let's... Ugh, I don't even know. I mean, I'd love to grow heartbeats. But, like, obviously that's not gonna happen. We could put a tree up here, a peach tree. How would I remember that that's where I put peach trees specifically though? I mean, I think the answer is I wouldn't. We all know I won't. Okay, we'll go up here. Maybe we'll fight this tree tree situation first. Okay, it's all the way up here to the top left. And then that should be good to go. But it's like actually crazy, right? So like you walk under them and just like the leaves somehow, like you don't have to go to like a magical, like, you know, dense forest or anything. You can just like exist in like, you know, a regular Pacific Northwest like area with trees and they can just, oh God, okay. Also, let's try to remember to use the tractor. It's the one button. I'm surprised I haven't accidentally used it. Um, with the way I fat finger to these keys, like you'd think I'd, I would have already managed to like just keep the tractor fully used, right? Oh man, okay, whoops. Not quite how I would have wanted to do that, but it's cool, it's cool. Earthquake seems great, because we're not getting the kind of pickaxes I want for the kind of real estate I need for these trees. Okay, there we go. Oof. Okay, yes, 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 yes. That's great news. Um, I don't think I can actually afford any of the... Really? Really? Like, that whole time I just sat there and, like, shot the stone pillar? Yeah, it really is just like me playing Apex. Okay. Okay, we didn't get hit that time, so we actually should, like, quickly try to find the, the statue place. Yes, yes, we have found the statue place. Cool, yes, heard us, that's great. 
But we have a stat up. Okay, great. Well, we only have two animals this time, so I think it's pretty safe to say that there's a 100% chance that we're going to lose all of them uh, to this whole UFB situation. Please, please don't burn me. Like, I, I just took some damage to get a better fighting stat. I can't afford this. Come on, get my... Yeah, there we go, there we go. So, how many animals? Okay, we actually still have the cow right now. I, I don't know, like, how long that's going to last or how this works, but wow, that's, that's what I want to hear. Really great news. Okay. I'm gonna use up all my fertilizer here, but that's it's fine, it's fine. We can get more. We're going to kill lots of things. Things I'm sure will continue to poop on the farm. It'll be great. Okay, plains, garden beds, and the jungle ones in a line. We're not doing any of that in a line garbage. Okay, first of all, I wanted to use this. Oh my god, it's devastatingly bad. Why why now will my farm have to look like this? Okay, cool. What do I want to plant? I want to plant some roses. Oh, that's right, they grow instantly. Bingo, that's great. Okay, please, don't attack me, I'm busy. Okay, at least we have these three turrets to help us out. Okay, beautiful. Uh, hmm. We don't have that many desert seeds, though. Like, it seems kind of irresponsible to put a desert seed down here, doesn't it? A desert garden bed? Whatever. Okay, we'll do it. I should have put the plains one down. Well, we can put the plains one down up there, okay? Are we gonna have some problems when we don't have, like, a four square soon? Yeah, mm-hmm, it's true. But uh, I guess that's a problem for future us. Um, this is an apple tree. Oh, we have an apple tree and two peach trees. Terrible news. Um, we'll put you over here, I guess. I'm like, you? You can go away. Actually, it should be this one here, I think, that should get removed. And then we can put it down here. Um, and it's here. Okay. Yes, yeah, so we don't have enough fertilizer for this to make any sense. Oh. Well, actually. Okay, when we get back, we'll actually use the fertilizer scroll. The fertilizer dove, you know, whatever. Oh, okay, we could afford the shallot gun. It's not horrible. And we have enough roses to marry, obviously, what's the love of our life. You know, we've known her for a whole two seasons, so. Okay, not quite perfect, but it was okay. I think we've hit bees, right? So they turn weeds into flowers, you know, slowly but surely. All those little benefits, they add up. I'd love a pig. I'd really love a pig. But let's see if we can afford to marry Rue and get a pig, because that is an ideal world. Oh, anything to get out of this place. How nice. Very romantic, you know. Um, let's see. Oh, cool, and we did get like an earthquake squirrel from this. Oh, hey, whoa, I almost missed a cornucopia. They blend right in, huh? Oh, we can afford a pig. Man, that's great news. I mean, we already have a drone, so like, we don't need another one. I mean, we do have that whole turrets and drones fire faster thing, which is primo, but, um, I definitely think that lukewarm legumes, yeah, you're right, it's much cooler than cool beans. And, I mean, it's got alliteration, right? Is that not always, like, what's cool? Okay, this will give us a much better fighting stat. We get toxic spores and more damage. Okay, it doesn't have a lot. Yeah, I mean, it's a, a two-shot shotgun there, so that's not going to work out incredibly well for us, but... Okay, so, let's use this scroll. <laughs> What a horrible patchwork. Man, they hate us. Um, okay, and then I guess I'll throw this down, and then I want to use this and see how much they feed the sunflower, which, as it turns out, is virtually nothing. Kind of incredible how much they don't give the sunflower. Okay. Well, I don't think I quite got there, but it's okay. Um, what do we have? Okay. So not too much going on in the tundra, honestly. We can head down to the, um... I'm going to kill them, but they won't pop out, huh? Okay, that one did. Take the fertilizer, get out of here. Yeah, we don't have a ton of money left over right now, but... Okay, that was better. Apparently my drone will just go ahead and, like, cause problems for me. Hopefully we'll be able to smartly take out those cats that are going to be in our way soon. Okay. Nice, nice. 
Um, so I just want to say that I'm really proud of myself for being able to hold off for this long on complaining about the whole, oh no, the cats. Complaining about the whole, like, Oscar situation. Um, I mean, first of all, you know, not nearly as excited, exciting as last year, you know, or where there was, like, so much drama. So, I mean, like, the awards themselves, nothing super redeeming there. And then, worst of all, right, um, were, like, the results of those, those shorts that got Oscars. Like, oh my god. Um, those are, like, basically the only thing I've seen. I haven't even seen everything everywhere all at once, which, I mean, that was the only movie you needed to watch if you were thinking about watching the Oscars, given, like, how the results turned out. Oh, an extra tractor slot. Wow, that's, like, for someone who can't remember how to use the tractors, um, that's maybe not even the best relic we could have gotten. I was hoping to kill them both with that one shot, which, I mean, it's okay. Okay, look, I know that we have an expansion problem, right? We need to expand the farm more. It's true, it's really true. But how can you say no to another cow? Like, how can you actually say no on a third cow? They probably shouldn't have done that, but, um, you know, I'm, I'm uniquely good at making bad decisions in this game, I think. So, that's like, that's my competitive advantage here, you know? Okay. I was hoping we'd kill all of those, but whatever. Okay, let's get rid of this cat. Did it work? Okay, that was better than hoped for. I mean, the shell gun's pretty powerful, which does genuinely make a lot of sense, but... Oh, this is terrible. I, I don't want three of either of these. I guess we'll take the cactus one and we'll make a point to go there soon. The, the cactus realm? Ca cactus biome? You know what I'm saying. Okay, well, the cows being more efficient is great with so many cows. Uh, we definitely need to get back before we you know, lose the tree, the only, the solitary tree. Okay, where are we at? Okay, so we're just to the side of this hole, right? Yes. So just to the left of the hole is like a whole new uh, artifact we can pick up tomorrow. Okay, let's combine everybody. Let's uh, not die to these people. I've got a lot of asks, apparently. I, I don't really see myself. I mean, we're trying to at least, um, Use up our organic armor, right? Otherwise, it's, it's just a waste of money. Okay. And let's harvest all of you. Oh, cool. The hit bees were doing their job. That's great. I guess that makes sense, right? They're probably going to turn flowers into weeds a lot more when there's nothing else for them to do. And there are lots of weeds. And I do not have a lot going on with my crops most of the time, it looks like. I don't have any chickens, do I? No, so these weeds are just getting like quite out of hand. Hmm. Well, I guess I can try to get some of these out of the way. We don't have any more date trees. I don't think I have any more. Wow. Yeah, that's all awful. Okay, well this one we can we can expand a little bit, right? So that's okay. Um, guess we could get these jungle seeds down. Better than nothing. Okay, we have a new four square place, which is nice. This is another four square section. It'd be nice to have a place to put more of those trees that we're like really starting to have quite a few. We have four trees we could plant that we have not done anything with, which is bad. Can't afford anything, don't go look. Don't look, jeez. Okay, plant seeds. I mean, I do kind of need more seeds and that is fairly cheap. Hummingbirds are not fairly cheap, don't look at that. Okay, return to the farm. Okay, I I swore to myself that we'd go to the better desert, so hopefully we do that today. Like, let's go through, let's finish up the jungle, and then let's head there. Man, I see that, like, we have, we have that much time. It's gonna be, like, what, like a two-minute day, though, right? Yeah, two minutes and 15 seconds, okay. Okay, so we get down to the middle, and then we go left, and there's something with an artifact. Beetle, please. I'm not sure what the actual relics, you know what I mean. Relics, artifacts, I don't know. Are they the same thing, am I? Oh gosh. I, I think we have to take Beehive for now. I want the fighting stat up, I mean I really do, but we already have like so much more fighting stat than farming stat. And on top of that, okay, so I think we've done like everything here basically, right? I'm not trying to fight them. 
That's awful. Yeah, let's just take this and let's go to Supreme Desert or whatever it's called. That sounds like a legitimate thing, right? Supreme Desert? But anyway, this way I feel like having a bunch of bees will maybe help us make up for the fact that we don't have any... Um, oh, don't walk into that. Um, that we don't have the other thing that I'm thinking of in my mind. Um, any chickens or turkeys. You know, that we have no fowl, I guess. You understand. It's a shame that speedy mushroom has worn off because we could really use that kind of boost right now. Okay, well, at least we have, you know, a taxi home. Okay, we got this going on. Oh, I was hoping that this would actually hit them, the toxic spore situation. Okay, we got another date tree, which is great because we have a date tree with space next to it. I don't want to, like, actually clutter everything up. Did, did I get hit? I got hit. Okay, okay. Did you get hit? Not, like, I feel like I didn't watch enough of The Walking Dead to, like, really get to quote it years later. But, um, clearly that won't stop these quotes from running rent-free in my head, so. So, what I'm saying is, if I have to think them, you have to hear them, I guess. Is how that works. Um, okay, cool. Well, some fertilizer from that's pretty nice. Ah! Okay, okay, don't walk into the bees then. Remember, they're still upset with you for killing them when you had the chance not to. Walk right into that one. Walked into all of these, apparently. Let's get back, like, just immediately, and then let's clear out a four square. Okay, you guys. And then let's go ahead and get this heartbeat seed down and let's try not to die i don't have like great faith in this but we'll see what we can do Whew. that weed is something else please calm down attack me less okay man we haven't even like put enough fertilizer on that to make it yeah that's some fertilizer We'll have another wave in five seconds and that'll give us plenty of fertilizer and a brand new chance to meet a horrific end. I think that's really important. Okay. Yep. Best to kill these as soon as we can. Oh, cool. Should we give us another pumpkin seed? We have six of those now, which is actually quite nice. Okay. Let's try to kill that guy. Apparently our turrets will do it for us. Yes, let's have the competent ones do the damage here. Wow, three cherry bombs. Okay, is this all... Oh my god, we still don't have enough fertilizer? Well, at least we have another wave starting. Lucky us. Whew, okay. But yeah, I am pretty not impressed with um, the, the short film selections, at least, right? Um, I can't believe I haven't watched everything everywhere all at once at this point, because... um, So, if you've ever played... Class. Um, so that's, it's kind of a, a niche. I don't even know, like, really, like, where you categorize it, because it's, like, not a board game. It's, like, um, it's really, like, air hockey, but without, you know, the automated air, like, mini, mini air hockey. Like, it's very small. Um, and so it's, like, on a, I guess, like, a plywood board, you know, it's, like, this big. And so it's, like, tiny little air hockey and uses magnets, or, like, you control, instead of, like, controlling your... Um, I want to say puck, and puck is the wrong word. You control your little, I don't know, your little thing, your side of it when you are uh, playing air hockey. And you use, like, you actually hold it from the bottom, and it's just like a magnet that you hold. And then you basically, you know, are trying to get the ball into the other person's goal. And it's like, you know, these like small, like little magnetic pieces or whatever. Um, do you think someday we could afford a gun? Probably not, huh? Uh, what do we have in terms of, we have like no plain seeds and like no desert seeds. We'll take these two. Since we have plenty of desert garden beds. And I forgot that we just to plant a tree. I was so concerned about the whole, are we all going to die here thing. It was silly of me, really. And I did not even pay attention to this. Okay, oh yeah, and then of course we also had the whole issue here where, um, there's like everything is covered in weeds. I mean, I appreciate what the bees are trying to do here, but they're a little slow, I'll be honest with you. Okay, that's a tundra bed. I mean, 
I guess it would be better to go ahead and plant them down here. Okay, and we're still energized. Please don't stop being energized. We need to keep working. I know that we should be out, you know, in the mega desert or whatever, but like being energized, I think is like very, very valuable for us. Put these down. So we'll hopefully get some more of those beds. And then maybe we can just clear out some of these, the weeds here. And like, it's also really hard to tell what's actually available. Okay. Because of like these, those awful earthquake scrolls I used and how they did not play very nicely with each other to create something that um, actually works. They didn't really do that. Okay, nice, nice. Little level up of the crops there. Okay, now that, that's what I'm talking about. Them creating their own seeds, that's what we really need here. Okay, cool. Okay, let's get out of here. Uh, if we take this, we should get back to the desert, right? Yep. And we'll try north. North seems nice today. Okay. Oh no, is this the Psy thing or is this just like the, the friend? I hope it's the friend and not the horrible death Psy. Okay. Uh, oh good, yes, I think we get just a ghost friend. And this is part of like the, the Deerville update. So it's like all spooky, you know? Okay. Well, we're certainly getting quite a few desert seeds. I guess I didn't have to spend the 70 bucks earlier to try to keep them, but I think it's useful. Okay, five roses. That's not bad. Wow. And look at the concerted effort of four different characters. I mean, I know that three of them are NPCs, but with the way I play, it looks like all four of them are. So you'd think that we could get that done. Oh, that was nice. Um, okay. Wow. That's less nice, I guess. Oh, is it really the boss line already? God, the music though, it's so catchy. Um, I think it's like really kind of interesting. Well, there are a variety of reasons that like the way the human brain works is really interesting. But I was convinced that there were sonic differences with, um, with the bosses. So, I mean, like, you know, each season obviously has its own, um, soundtrack, right? For the boss, like they're all different. But I was sure that, like, each boss had a different sound. Um, and I was, like, convinced of this. But it's not true. It's not true at all. So, okay, this this whole extra... Okay, we're done with Unlimited, huh? Okay, that sucks. That's fine. Um, but yeah, the Unlimited... I... Wow, okay. I didn't deserve to not get hit there with how slow I was being. I also like that this guy is alive still with what appears to be literally zero health. Okay, finally, he picked the bucket. That's nice. Okay, yeah, these weeds are, like, becoming a menace on the farm. You know, um, isn't chamomile a menace? Um, I called it pineapple weed, which, I mean, is, is a colloquial way of referring to it, but I had no idea that pineapple weed was chamomile for, like, I don't know, the first 15 years of my life, and I would, like, talk about it. It was great. Um, I mean, it's always exciting, like, the ways that you can find to, like, display uh, your embarrassing levels of ignorance. Oh, this is not filled in. Okay, well, it's about to be. Ah! Wow. That was very close. I need to pay attention, because when the ghost, like, you know, lights up like that, he's thinking about doing something exciting and cool. Uh, I need to pay better attention to that. Yep, see, look, he's got the exclamation mark. Oh, here we go, okay. Unlimited pickaxes, that's what I want in my life. I mean, this isn't how I would have done it, I guess, but... Okay, like, geez, did I, didn't I just, like, clear off a patch over here? Look, let's just try to get these roses down so we can have a, a few more. Cool. Oof. Oh, and we definitely need to get this tundra garden bed down. Um, since they're making their own seeds right now. That makes a lot of sense to me. Okay. Well, yeah, again, we're never seeing a gun upgrade. Like, forget that. Uh, cool. Maybe we'll get something good, though, from the mayor. Okay, stuff. But we got chrono weeds, which would have been really nice on that one where we had uh, crampons. And then, oh, 
Okay, hang on. Rose bouquet. You trade three roses and you get... Okay, you, you get more than that. Because now I have three more than I did. <laughs> okay, cool. I mean, a bouquet is normally a dozen. Obviously, they're not going to give you a dozen. Energize all friends to max when you take damage. Oh, unlimited fertilizer while we're here. Excellent. Hmm. Well, we can't quite afford a hog. We do have a turkey now. I don't know when that happened. Um, maybe not a good sign for me, but... I mean, I really want... Okay, but we don't need a mega tree, okay? There's a lot of things that we need, but a mega tree is just not one of those things. So, let's maybe be a little bit wiser, shall we? Let's at least try. Okay. Okay, perfect. See, this is the kind of work I want to see these bees doing. Like, that's, that's good stuff right there. Okay, I do want to go ahead and expand this right here, though. Yeah, so we'll put the tundra thing down. I don't want to waste the fertilizer, honestly. Plains bed, things merge. Oh, yeah, we should just gain another tundra bed, though. Like, there's just kind of no, there's no way we don't want to do that. And then look, we'll go back to the other place very soon, okay? Uh, wow. Uh, tundra bed right here. Cool. Oh, I see. We gained a little bit of extra time because of the... Um, the turkey eating stuff. Thank you, turkey, for eating stuff. Oh my god, really? We waste the organic armor before we even get going? Mm, excellent. We're off to a fantastic start. Okay, so we can just throw down this four square pumpkins. Like, let's just get it going. And then, okay, I managed to avoid getting hit by any of those. Oh, hey, look! The aliens returned an animal. Uh, the aliens returned a little alien. That's very cute. That's extremely cute. I'm glad they're here doing that. You know, living with us on Earth. Uh, apparently also they're, like, cutting weeds, which is cool. Like, the tiny alien cuts weeds everywhere it goes. Ooh, unlimited fertilizer. Okay, well, let's go ahead and waste that. Oh, okay, and that's all my actual fertilizer now. No, thank you. Cool, cool. Okay, not bad, honestly. Um, and we can keep the little alien helping us out. We'll have to, like, take it on a tour of the farm soon. I should probably talk to that guy before I go this way. The gopher. I should go talk to the gopher. Yes, of course. Um, because we're still working on the desert up here, right? Just barely, it looks like. Maybe we can hurry up and clear this one and then go somewhere else. Did we have the two tractor perk? Nope, that's, yes, yes, we do. Okay. I'm like, how many runs have we had? We've actually only had the two, so I shouldn't really um, be that confused. Of course, I've never wasted my time worrying about what I should or shouldn't be confused about. I'm clear to just be confused all the time. Okay. The little alien is very cute. I am glad that it's here helping out. Um, kind of a weird apology, too. Uh, we have, yeah, this, so they fire faster, so definitely a turret makes the most sense. Oh, man, it's all the way northward? That's not ideal, honestly. Okay, we'll take another earthquake. Clearly, I haven't learned my lesson from the first couple of earthquakes we've used that have kind of made the farm hideous. Oh, no, it's an angry moon. Oh, no. Okay. What are you going to do for me, ghosty? Uh, it waters stuff? Waters things quicker? Not totally sure what's going on there. Okay, we've harvested stuff. So now when, you know, when the witch sets things back in time, it won't matter too much. We have enough for a heartbeat, like a four square heartbeat. So if, um, if and when we take like just a ton of damage on this night, we'll be okay, which is awesome. Okay, please try not to destroy the trees. I really want to get more of the trees down. Maybe we can do that after this night ends. Oof. Maybe that will make sense. But yeah. Um, so I was pretty, I'm pretty like not pleased with like any of the Oscar shorts. And like this is also like my first year that I've ever really like paid attention to the Oscars. Um, so, you know, like went out of my way to like watch the Oscar shorts and like, you know, try to be interested in that sort of thing. And, um, 
that's not quite what I meant to do. I meant to switch, but okay, it's cool. It's fine. I'm doing great. Let's see about maybe putting down another turret. And now we've got some more space. Maybe we could put down not just another turret, but perhaps, in fact, um, some trees. I would love to do that because I've decided the trees are great. I mean, they they are, you know, like a free, a free fruit or vegetable, I suppose. Free crops. They're free crops. That's what I'm saying. Okay, so I put these two right next to each other. These are the peach ones in the north, which is, you know, confusing in and of itself. But honestly, this isn't like the worst of these kinds of nights that we've had before. Um, plains bed merge that a fertilizer. What's this one? Desert ones drop random seeds. Okay, I feel like merging without a fertilizer is a much better deal. That doesn't, the other one doesn't seem like that great. I mean, I would take it, I guess, if we had no other thing that we wanted instead, but. Okay. Apparently I saved just taking massive amounts of damage for like, I don't know, times when it's embarrassing to do that because nothing's happening. Maybe it's also a little bit easier because we have the the weeds timer thing. Like maybe that's like just just really like helping more than we are giving it credit for. I, mean, I don't know. Could be. Okay, I'll go ahead and throw the apple tree down here. This way, it's like fairly far from the other tree. So we, when we put the banana tree down, because that one's really easy to tell apart from the others. Yeah. So I'm I'm like really annoyed about those those shorts. I'm particularly angry about like the. Uh, the the short the animated short that won is just like is so bad um but like here's here's my issue right because like i have a lot of like pretty pretty harsh opinions right but the problem that i have is like you know i don't mean to be like quite so harsh because like i do understand you know like people worked on this you know what i mean like nobody like set out to make like the world's worst animated short that happens to get Oscar nominated, right? Like that's not like anybody's dream. And uh, I'm perhaps a little a little unfair. Like I had um, so I just I really love like criticism in general. You know, like I like literary criticism, and I like you know I enjoy partaking in you know games critiques. And I like to read you know other reviews and things like that. But um, but I have like all of my own very like harsh opinions. And so, um, I just, like, I, I wrote, um, I wrote this paper when I was in college that was just so absolutely, like, unreasonably cruel to, um, it was about Mary Shelley's Frankenstein. And, um, I just, like, I just was so, so harsh. And, like, it, it's not like I don't feel that way, but it was, it was kind of unnecessarily cruel, but, like, I didn't feel too bad about it. Because I'm like, well, you know, Mary Shelley's dead, right? Like, it doesn't matter if I, like, write this truly scathing, you know? Because um, it was sort of a personal attack, too, because it was basically like, um, you know, oh, I, I feel like it's it's basically just this whole, like, woe is me kind of uh, story. Like, I, I feel like it's like a very, like, self-pitying uh, book as well. And so I, uh, I was, like, very, like, it was kind of a personal attack as well. And I was like, okay, but she's dead, right? So like it doesn't matter how scathing of a review or you know like I write or talk about you know like it, she's dead you know she's not really going to be like too offended by me being like oh you know you clearly have just a bunch of unresolved issues and like you know I wish you wouldn't sit around and just self pity yourself and then like write this book about it and like you know so we all have to tell you it's good um but you know that that being the case right like the people who made these Oscars presumably are like largely still alive, um, which is like a different matter altogether. So I wish that I might, oh wow, a current, that's, that's pretty great actually. You know, I just wish that I would manage to be like a little bit gentler on this because I mean like I really do feel like the, the animated Oscar short that won, it's like the boy, the horse, the fox, the mole or something. I don't remember in which order the animals uh, fall, but it's like, it's like truly, it's the worst thing I've ever watched. I really like, I think it's egregiously bad. And somehow like it won an Oscar. 
And I can only imagine, like, what their criteria was for judging it. Because, like, look, I'll, I'll try to be, you know, fair. Because, like, the animation is beautiful, okay? Like, that that's just the truth. Um, it's all, like, hand-drawn animation. So it's, it's truly, it's gorgeous. You know, it's really well done. It clearly looks like uh, a ton of time and effort, you know, like, went into the creation of it. But the content, and apparently it's based on a kid's book. So I haven't read the kid's book. So maybe, you know, maybe it's just like, maybe it's one for one. You know, it's just a copy of the content of the kid's book. Because if that's the case, like, I, I mean, I probably should harbor less hate in my heart in general. But I should, like, ease off on my anger about it. Sorry, I just wanted to go through here. I thought we could get a little bit. Collect the weeds. Gain some money. Ooh, free pickaxe day. Let's get some of these down for sure. As long as this lasts, you know. Come on. Okay, well, I mean, that's honestly, like, that's pretty good. I really should not complain about that one. Um, okay. What could we put down here? Oh, we have another date seed? Huh. Huh. Okay. Well, we could make room for another date tree. But that that's outside this way. That won't make a four square. Am I a fool? Oh my god, have I just, like, put these all in the wrong place? I think I have. Well, I mean, I guess I, I just kind of grew around them. Which is not going to go super well for making them into a four square. I can't remove it, can I? Can I remove these garden beds? It doesn't look like it. Well, I guess I can hope for an axe being sold at the shop, but there are two of the trees here, so... Yeah, we'll just take some damage, huh? Here, well... Whew. Um... Oh, a little spicy, sure. Okay, let's get these down. Oh my god, really? I guess that, that just that uh makes things more exciting for me, right? Okay. So we don't have enough fertilizer now, which is awesome. Ghost, do you wanna give me like unlimited fertilizer or something? Because you could, you could do that right now. Oh good, another wave. Another wave, another opportunity for us to get fertilizer. Isn't that isn't that right? Oh my goodness. Okay. Hey, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not acceptable behavior. Oh, wow. That's that's truly, truly terrifying. Okay, we still don't have enough fertilizer. Uh, awesome. The next wave is really soon. I was kind of hoping it might grow a little faster. Come on. Like, what's this uh, grows faster at night business for if you're not going to actually grow? Okay. Oh no, I was trying to go up and to the left, and I did not thread that needle. That is not what it looks like when you thread a needle. Oh, that's painful. Okay, let's see how the farm grew. I mean, you can kind of see, look, that was like me trying to control it. Then this was the earthquakes making everything go like super out of hand. And then, you know, we just sort of gave up on it being neat or orderly at all. And then we died. Isn't that lovely? You get to see a whole life. Okay, well, let's do one more run. Um, unless this run, you know, ends in, like, the first, uh, I don't know, <laughs> like, the first season, and then we'll do another. Um, reduce tractor cooldowns, and some special upgrade for a tractor I don't use. Okay, whatever, let's just take, see, I would rather take half a percent of luck, uh, instead. But that's alright, that's alright. Okay, so you know the drill. Let's go ahead and set this up, get these planted. Honestly, there's no point, I guess. Maybe I should just leave. Maybe that'll be my new strat. Abandonment strat. Okay. We'll go through here. It'd be better if we hit the hermit crab first, but instead, we're just gonna focus on having a nice, clean game. I say as I take my first hit. Okay, maybe not quite what we're looking for there. A real shame. Truly. Such a shame. Like, that last run was going, I thought, like, okay, you know? But year three is really not the year for me, you know? So, yeah, I mean, like, in truth, I didn't really love, you know, like, any of the Oscar shorts I watched. I thought they were all, like, kind of bad. Um, and maybe, maybe that's maybe that's too harsh, right? Like, um, I would say that the, the animated short that was French... Uh, whose title I can't remember, but it was in French, um, I think. Oh god, what if it wasn't? Okay, uh... 
clearly I'm not allowed to read and uh, move at the same time. Or at least move and not take damage at the same time, which I guess is fair. Okay, well at least, look, a tractor. Maybe we can pay attention to the tractor situation. We can be better about tractors this game, okay? This is the run that's not only flawless, uh, ignore those first three hits we've just taken, but simultaneously a run in which we pay lots of attention to tractors. Oh, well, we'll see what we can do. Um, all right, okay, cool. This is actually wonderful. I wonder if we can see where it's gonna be. No, we can't yet. Okay. I guess I'll just try to clear out this node. We'll try not to get hit in the back with that one that's like inevitably, definitely just from a roach, which is terrible. Okay, please, not now, friends. You guys are like just nothing but trouble. Okay, and there's an extra rose seed down here. And we never saw where the other one went, so that sucks. Okay. So let's see if we can get these down. Um... Oh, that's right, okay, it was still dusk. I was like, man, it's, it's very quiet. Yeah, see, and like, we can't for some reason seem to find the, uh, I want to find where the berries are in the beginning, you know? Because like, the berries on day one might be the difference between like, buying a gun and not buying a gun for us, which is pretty significant. So, cause like, I'm having to get used to the pea shooter the first two days, and the pea shooter is garbage, so. I would love if we didn't have that going on. Honestly, we should probably just go ahead and plant them in this, like, extra space, even though we can't get a four square out of them. What was the deal with the four square app? It was just, like, you, you checked in for, like, your, your physical location, and you would be like, I went to this place, or, like, I'm here at this place, and it's just sort of like a, like a let people know where you are, what you're doing sort of thing. I mean, like, nowadays, Google Maps just does that for you. You don't even have to tell anybody, you know? They'll, they'll stalk you without you having to put in any kind of effort. So, maybe that's why Foursquare got phased out. Uh, okay, cool. I would at least like them to all be fertilized if we can't have them be, like, a Foursquare. It'd be cool if we could get a little bit of extra. Maybe this will give us some... Cool. At least there's enough fertilizer for sure. But at least we can harvest them all. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it worked for that one, it looks like. Okay, and then we can go ahead and get another four square down. I did not mean to do that, but I think you can tell. But I mean, that's actually completely okay, because then we have space for two four squares. Apparently, I, I really favor this whole uh, extremely narrow vertical structure. Oh, man. Okay, so it's 70. So yeah, we'll never, we'll never see this. Don't look, don't look. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what they're selling. If you can't afford it, it shouldn't matter. Okay. Yeah, what is it they say? You know, if you have to ask if you can't afford it, and here we are. How do we wind up with any plain seeds? Doesn't that seem kind of weird? We didn't go there at all. And then we can get another four square. Some little pricklies going. So that should work out. Okay, awesome. And then perfect, they'll all just die of dehydration. I mean, at least we don't have the mole thing going on. Yeah, you know, that's weird. We didn't even make it to see like a deer, deal with the deer vault. Oh God, it's a tongue twister. A tongue twister on top of trying not to take damage like I'm just now doing. I mean, clearly look. You know, I was like, oh, we'll only do one more run assuming I don't die in the first season. Well, we don't even have any heartbeat seeds. Oh my God. I, I totally misjudged the amount of space you need. Like, oh man. How old do you have to be to get LASIK? Okay, so let's try one more. This is certainly uh, how basically every other uh, year three run has gone that I've been playing by myself, so. And not on stream. Uh, look, I know we didn't, like, we tried not putting those seeds down before, but I think it didn't go very well for us last time. So, that's my, that's my opinion. But yeah, I mean, just like, I don't know. I, it's also curious too, because like, I think it's all, it's all very strange the way that like shorts work at all. Because like shorts are like kind of interesting and I feel like they're like a nice bite-sized chunk of media to consume. Like I really like them because I'm somebody who is like, I have just have terrible commitment issues by like watching movies. Um, I blame this on my upbringing 
uh, because when I was, I was a kid, the extended cut Lord of the Ring movies were like my mother's background movies. So what I would listen to all the time and inevitably get like completely sucked into, even though I'd seen it like dozens of times, was like, you know, this three and a half, four hour long movie. And so like my brain, like it cannot conceive of a movie that doesn't last a minimum of three hours. And so I'm like, oh no, I don't have time to watch a movie. You know, like that'll eat up my whole evening. There's no way. Um, and I mean, but then of course, you know, you can find yourself watching, binging like an entire show and then don't even do the math on like how long that is. But um, yeah, so I, I have like commitment issues about watching movies. So I feel like, you know, short films are kind of perfect for that, right? I mean like, shows of course kind of like fulfill that but i mean like they explore they can explore some really fun concepts and i mean like i really like short fiction um like you know in podcasts and stuff like that so um i think it's kind of a shame there's not like a better venue to watch them because like you know if you want to watch a movie i mean you know how to find movies you know that's like not a confusing thing to do if you're like okay uh, i want to see a movie you know you can stream movies or you can, okay, let's try not to die to this guy, huh? Um, there's like clearly a roach infestation here. Like, welcome to Florida, nothing but palmetto bugs. Um, oh, that was too close. I saw it too late. That one I have no excuse for though. Uh, we should probably actually start, yeah, wiggling him back around over to his like original spawn point because I want to get the goodies from that. Oh my God. Okay, clearly, like, I cannot just, like, be that far back from the screen. Maybe that's the issue. Yeah, for sure. God, I saw, um, I was reading one of those, like, Onion article sites about someone who thinks they no way. There's no, no way, first of all, I took that damage. Second of all, no way that I accidentally just walked through that second frickin' tunnel and, like, oh my god. Something was eating my crops. This is a nightmare. We don't even have a tractor yet. I was like, I could try to remember to use a tractor, but I can't even do that. Okay, you should die while I'm clearing weeds. Yes, yes, go away. Giving this one slug my attention. Well, like, I just completely get owned by like a pack of wild rabbits behind me. Whatever. Clearly, this is, this is my lifestyle choice. Um, okay. Let's keep moving here. Well, let's get these prickles down. We're doing great. Yes, yes, perfect. And then we'll just combine them, and we still won't have enough money for anything, and it'll be it'll be perfect, just like in the simulations. Okay. Um. So let's finish combining these. Okay. Now they're done. We can at least put another prickly down. Get a four square going. We don't have enough pickaxes to put down a tree, which I I wish we did. Um, but I think it's probably better that we just put these down instead. And we'll fertilize these. Get some of the weeds gone. Okay. Could be worse. Could be worse. Okay, we can't afford anything. Okay, don't, don't even look. Okay, we do so bad on this first day in year three. They're like, we just, we don't even need to be hurting ourselves by looking. Okay. Okay, and then let's put like one of these down here that way okay so we do still have some of the desert to clear maybe we can be quick about it but I feel like you know what is it they say fast is slow that, that's not right it's uh slow is fast you, you know what I'm talking about fast makes mistakes or whatever so play it slow and that's secretly fast isn't that the, is the message the moral of that strange truism Okay, not really close enough to hit the hermit crab. Hermit crab, please come back. God, hermit crabs are such angry little creatures. I think it's really funny that they're like still a semi-common like children's pet. Because like as far as like kids' pets goes, you know, you think you generally like, I don't know, want them to have like a personality that isn't like just loathing. Because I feel like that, that comprises like, yeah, they might have a personality, but their personality is just like, you know, Pure seething rage, barely contained by like a small shell. Chrono weeds and eggs give fertilizer. I guess I'll take that one. Maybe I should have taken the day length one. Like I know we're not cutting weeds right now, but see, like we just got a chicken. I mean, we potentially will just get a chicken. 
we will potentially just die in the pursuit of desperately trying to get a chicken. It's crazy the places you can raise a chicken though, man. Like, I've seen people with chicken coops like, okay, please, please. This, this whole deciding to go fast thing, it hasn't worked out for us. Let's be careful, please. Okay, we can do this. Oh, okay. See, like, when we miss every shot afterwards, I have less of a feeling of we can do this than I do a feeling of, oh god, we're going to die. At least we have a heartbeat seed now. We didn't before, and last run we didn't at all, so there was no hope. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Oh, we got five roses. Okay, so we get back. We just, we just harvest them all. And we get... We get the roses down. So look, if we're gonna die anyway, okay? Then it, it doesn't matter. Yeah, you know, we're gonna die before the heart beats full grown. Okay, perfect. And then now, we can put a little heartbeat here and try not to die. Okay. And then we still don't have enough fertilizer, but don't worry. We'll kill all these guys. And then we'll have so much fertilizer left over, it'll be perfect. I mean, that one actually did kind of work out. Believe it or not. Truly, I'm having a hard time believing it. Okay. Nice. And then... Who are we even hoping to grow next? We don't have any pickaxes, so I guess we'll just throw some prickly seeds down. I mean, I guess it's fine. They are so strong. Muy fuerte, you know? Please, go away. We got some fertilizer. Okay, that's like a reasonable amount of fertilizer too. It's not just like one fertilizer that comes out of the egg. So maybe it is worth something. Remember, I must, I must lean in towards the computer, otherwise there's no chance for me. Okay, if I stand on those and they should stop being a problem. Okay. Let's kill this one. He's close. And also the bomb ones cause a lot of problems for us. So, valuable investment. Okay. And then we'll just kind of, I guess, give them... Oh, man. Really? Just barely, huh? Okay, well... Oh, yes! Perfect! That's great news. Maybe we can even put a date down. I say, optimistically. Okay, well, I mean, this is one of those days where we got saved by cactus fruits, you know? Prickly pears aren't bad. Okay, we, we actually can look at these. Watering crops is good, scarecrow masks, I don't know. Nothing's like, obviously, we couldn't live without it, so... Okay, I'll take a butcher knife. What? I said a butcher knife, but I obviously don't want that. That was what I was actively saying I don't want. So we'll do this instead. Easy, easy. Hmm, I mean, honestly, honestly, maybe we should just throw down the date tree. But why can't we, is there a, okay. Okay, and then we'll still just keep growing pricklies in the space. I mean, like, yes, it's a waste. Yes, I wish we were doing a four square, but it seems important to just get something down because we really, can't afford anything at any point. No, 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 you should die. I don't love the blunder bloom because it doesn't have any of that knockback, you know? It doesn't push enemies away from you as you're shooting. Which, I mean, I literally just described what knockback was for you. You're welcome. Okay, we'll go to the plains. Yeah, I mean, look at that. That's not killing anything. Oh. Yeah, I don't want to destroy this because they usually have fertilizer. Did I even hit that one? Remains to be seen, I guess. Okay. But yeah, I mean, I'm less angry about, like, the live-action one. I feel like the live-action one is, like, it was fine. I definitely feel like it was, like, Oscar bait. Um, because the not-animated short, the live-action short. Yeah, I can use my words. You see that? Um, that one was alright, right? It's, like, the story of, like, uh, these two brothers and... One of them has, like, a, a mental disability of some sort, and so, like, he was kind of being taken care of by their mother. He's, like, you know, fairly high-functioning, um, but, like, you know, needs somebody to kind of, like, live on the farm with him, but their mom died of cancer, and so, like, he came back from, like, the city. He's in, like, London or something. It's, like, an Irish one. Um, 
And so, uh, oh dear, wow, that worked out better than we had any right to hope it would have. Um, and so he's like, you know, I, I am just kind of spoiling it for you here. But, you know, basically, um, you know, the, the guy wants him to stay on the farm and, like, you know, keep the farm alive or whatever, not sell the farm and, you know, and spend more time with him and stuff. Because, like, the brothers are kind of estranged as well, you know, they don't talk much. And, um, anyway, so instead, though, you know, and so, of course, like, what happens, like, apparently their mom left a bucket list. So they go through and they, like, do all the stuff on their mom's bucket list. Um, only to find out that, like, their mom did write a bucket list, but, um, the brother didn't actually get to see it. Um, and so instead he, like, made up a bunch of stuff so that they could, like, spend more quality time together, right? Which is, like, sweet and heartwarming, you know? Like, that's nice. Um... But the, the whole deal with it, right, is like, of course, the ending kind of has this, this very, like, stereotypical happy ending, right? Um, the, the guy who was living in London decides to give up that life and, like, move to this rural farm and, like, live out, you know, his days, presumably with no internet. And, like, you know, I guess, I guess like, learning to, to, like, live on a farm while, like, kind of helping take care of his brother. Um, and so it's just, like... I guess, like, what I'm saying is I was hoping that, like, at this point in, in like, our cultural, like, you know, storytelling mythos that we would, like, have space for not grittier stories, but just stories that, like, have more nuance, you know? Because, like, I was hoping that, like, maybe it would, like, find a happy ending that involves more compromise, right? Like, with the ties between the brothers being, like, men did and, like, you know, maybe they don't, like, sell the farmhouse, but they sell, because it's, like, 150 acres, you know, which is a lot of farmland for you to, like, work by yourself, right? Um, and so, hmm, garden beds or jungle seeds? I guess we'll, we'll be going to the tundra next. Anyway, I was just, like, hoping for a more nuanced perspective, right? Because it's hard for me to, like, look at, like, a story that's, like, someone... Like, he clearly, like, has a life in London, you know? And so, like, for him to, like, give up that life fully, like, as a 180, and, like, to not find compromise, you know? It just, it seems to me like you would... Like, that that would be something that's, like, more interesting and satisfying and nuanced in, like, the modern era, right? Like, maybe their ties are still connected and, like, you know, they don't sell the house or, you know... Like, it, it just, it seems very impractical to think that, like, that's a real solution, you know? That you might, like, actually get someone who is like, you know what, never mind. You know, my, my connection is, like, so powerful that I want to give up the whole rest of my life. Because, like, that's not necessarily, like, a happy ending, you know? Like, that's, that's something that maybe, like, who knows? Maybe the guy is, like, you know, we have no idea. They never say, like, what his career is, you know? Maybe, like, what he's doing in, like, the UK is his passion. Maybe it's not. Maybe the farm is, like, a great opportunity for him to, like, start over because he, like, hates what he's doing. I mean, but the point is, like, that's not there. And so, like, I just feel like that lack of nuance, I'm like, it doesn't seem like a very happy ending to have someone decide to, like, completely abandon their previous life that they seem happy enough with. But, I don't know. You know, I, I just kind of, oh, man, okay. Perfect. But yeah, I don't know, I just feel like, I just felt like we had space for a little bit more nuance, you know? And the, the fact that, like, it's such, like, an obviously, like, predictable, happy ending that's, like, just very standard, I just felt like was, like, I don't know. I just felt like that that is kind of what it feels like when they say Oscar bait, you know? <laughs> like, that is not particularly satisfying or unique but it is like a direct appeal to emotion and so and so you know like that that's what wins out which is just like not again not satisfying you know look what if we just went what if we went a little nuts and we went just straight oh we can't afford it <laughs> so we'll not be doing that i mean we may be going nuts in other ways but certainly not in this way but I mean, I don't know, it's not like I know, like, which of the live action ones I would really have been like, oh, these are so much better, you know? I mean, like, I didn't have... Like, it was, it was funny because when I was trying to, like, pick, like, my favorites and kind of reflect on, like, which ones I liked and what I liked about them and what I thought worked and, you know, all of that, right? I'm, like, reflecting on these films and it was just, it was so much easier for me to be like, oh, um, these are the films I liked the, the least. Like, it was easier to rank from least to worst, or sorry, from worst 
to less worse because it was just like a matter of picking lesser evils. Um, at least that's, that's how it felt to me. So, oh gosh, we almost lost those roses. And that's no good. Okay, let me figure out of some of them. Okay, yeah, so look, so we've, we've picked up actually enough cashews that we could go northward, should we be so inclined. I am, I am somewhat inclined, I'll be honest with you. Oh my goodness, please. Like, relax, that's, you're too intense. Okay, cool. Alright, I don't know if there's anything else. Oh, we don't have a tractor yet. We should probably see to get the tractor. But then I'm telling you, we go northward all crazy, you know? Ah, uh, cool. And I mean the wood chipper tractor, it's got some value. Nothing incredible, of course, but some value nonetheless. Hello, chicken. Okay, so yeah, so we go northward, okay? I know, I know, I know. But look, this, this spud, spud cannon or whatever, it's not horrible. Okay, that's horrible. Yeah, yeah, that is. Okay, well, we squiggled out of that situation. Nice, nice. That's a cow? We already have a cow? Okay, I'm still taking a second cow, though. Like, you can't stop me. Good judgment can't even stop me, so I don't know why you think you have a chance, you know? Um, okay. There we go. And then we should just head back. Yes, yes, we should head back. Did we get any seeds from them? Because we could stay long enough to get seeds, uh, assuming we don't. No! Yeah, okay, cool. I mean, that was our organic, organic armor. Well, what in, like, what is taking me so long? Okay, there we go. Maybe this spud cannon is not as powerful as I was hoping it would turn out to be. For real? Did you see that we got one tundra seed out of that? So out of this whole mission, we got, like, two. Two additional tundra seeds. I did like the welcoming committee, that was nice. They did a pretty good job there, I think. Something's eating my crops, that's not cool. Okay, there you are. Okay, um, we've gotten plenty of heartbeats though. Like, that's actually really, really excellent. I was not expecting that. I was hoping to grow roses, which I think we can go ahead and do. But, Okay, we gotta get them planted here. Let's get you. No way. Oh, goodness. Why? Here, that's okay. We can make up for my own failings here. Okay, look, and then we plant a rose here. And then we plant another rose here. And look, we make another four square right over here. It's gonna be beautiful. Okay, I see we're also energized. That's helping quite a bit. And then, yeah, I want to do the heartbeat seeds there, for sure, for sure. Okay. Nice. Oh, that's, that's excellent. We should definitely get, no freaking way. We can't afford cow house? God, that's horrible. Uh, okay. Hmm. I would like a bee. We can't afford a bee, but I would like one, you know? Of course, I'd want more than one bee. You'd obviously want an entire hive. You don't want him to get lonely. Okay, we have enough fertilizer for this. We can make this happen. Cows, please do your job. There are two of you. Surely, you can manage it. Okay. So that's fine. Where could we put that delightful thunder bed? Maybe up here. Okay. And again, I know better, I know better. Look, I'm going to head upwards, up north, very, very soon, okay? Very soon. Perfect, just enough in time for me to get energized when we don't need to plant anything now. Excellent. Okay, um, maybe we'll just, like, throw a solitary jungle seed here. Enjoy, have fun. Go there as well, okay? Um, hmm. And a cactus seed here. Oh, that was hidden. Okay, let's get out of here. This place is getting crazy. What? What did I just hit? Is that the fertilizer one? Oh dear. Yes, clearly. Given that it appears to be everywhere. Okay. Whew, let's get out of here. Okay, we have a minute. A minute left to get many more tundra seeds so that that can be our money maker. Oh yeah, for sure. Hmm. 
Okay. Well, what's the map tell us? Okay, I guess we can go this way. I mean, I suppose the map tells us we can go either direction since we just got to this biome. That's okay. Um, I don't know. I mean, if everything is irradiated, I, it's weird that the berries are like, they seem fine. Like, that, that alone makes them kind of suspicious. Maybe it's some kind of like a adaptive behavior they've come up with that uh, enables you to. It just makes them look like they're not irradiated so that people will eat them more, you know? Uh, they create their own seeds. Absolutely excellent. Now we don't even have to worry about getting arctic seeds here. They'll just transform into something else. That's so much better. That snow globe situation is where it's at. Okay, what what's the other... Oh, there you are. Okay, we got, we got rid of the owl, though. They, they do some bad work when it comes to the weird things. The weird pattern. We'll take Rosebow, okay? Gosh. No, don't don't be tempted, okay? Just be good. It's not like you have that much health to mess around with. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, there's that. It's nice that I don't, like, you know... Uh, it is nice that they don't include all realism all the time with this game because I can tell you I'm really appreciative of the fact that we don't have to deal with uh you know like taking cold damage or something you know in the frosty biome and tundra I suppose um I think that would be uh quite awful okay let's hurry up and get this down please hurry up it would be super great if we could get this down, because then these will just keep growing all evening, which is perfect. Okay, let's make sure everything stays fertilized. And then slowly but surely, we'll do a ton of farm work, uh, get energized, and then not be able to do anything about it. Like, <laughs> then just not have any use for it. Okay. Those uh, spud cannons or potato rifles or whatever, they are supposed to be like very cool. Um, they're supposed to be pretty, pretty heavy duty and um, they seem like they might be a little bit of fun to make, I suppose. Um, if a bit dangerous, you know. Okay, let's see. Awesome. Really important to harvest the tundra ones, you know, as quickly as we can. Okay, so we're on our third wave, which means I need to hurry, is what that means. I don't think there's anything else I was trying to... Oh gosh, yes, let's get you harvested. Well, it'll be nice. Um, maybe the arctic things will keep us going. Desert garden beds and sowing plains seeds in a line. I'm not really trying to do that, so I guess we'll take the desert garden beds, but... Ah... Uh, Sure, maybe we can just throw it down right here. This is fine. It's nothing special, but at least we've got crops growing. We can go and attack these guys, get a little more fertilizer. You know, the usual. I was hoping we get something else that we could plant. That's okay. We got a four square space here. Oh, hello. Oh man, man, that's a that's some terrible timing. We had that happen with the roses earlier too. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Okay, well that's not great. I mean... Uh, I'm not that... that enthused by the killing enemies energizes you thing. It's okay, for sure. Oh, well we could get tundra seeds and then get other seeds instead, I guess? Sure, let's just take the seeds, it's fine. Okay, we have a peach tree we can plant, but instead we should definitely, you know, as swiftly as possible go elsewhere so let's just go um we're still exploring tundra that's the current plan there's maybe a little bit of plain stuff left for us to pursue but i don't think it's going to hurt us to um get like you know random seeds if there's nothing in particular we're looking for i guess desert seeds would be nice but i think in the random seeds you know look i mean our first one was a desert seed so that's perfect can't ask for anything more than that you know wow this takes forever 
So I don't, I don't think that this is the case, but it really feels like, you know, with each passing day, the enemies themselves become more difficult. I don't think it's true. We don't have anything for, like, turrets, right? So let's just take another chicken, and let's try not to be in the situation that we were in last time, where the weeds were, like, hurting us. Because honestly, that's kind of embarrassing. Oh, that's where you are. I wondered. Ah, oh, sentient snowmen. Oh, hang on. Okay, so we put the tractor there. Look at that. We used a tractor. That was, uh, something we swore we would do. So, we're keeping our word a little bit. Nice to have a gourd. Oh, man. I mean, I'm definitely going to take another cow is the thing. I feel like the watering is just so important. I mean, mostly because it is. Like, you can't have the crops without it, right? You can, like, you can go without chickens or bees. But you can't, like, the crops themselves will not actually improve unless they're watered. You know, they won't advance. Okay, surely there's, like, some we've missed here. We have 35 seconds left. It seems like I've never cleared one this fast. So, I, mean, I know this is over two days, but still. They probably are just missing things. That seems a lot more likely. Oh, dear. Yeah, I think it's really great that we don't have to deal with, like, you know, it being unreasonably cold or whatever, because obviously this biome is freezing. I mean, a nuclear winter is supposed to be particularly bad, right? So, you'd think we'd have to bundle up, but, you know, maybe we're like those, um, you know, the, the Scandinavian babies that, you know, like, they'll put them outside for, like, nap time? Um, and maybe we're like that. Maybe, like, you know, they bundle us up, and then we head into this biome, and then, uh, we just take a nice nap. Okay, so thank goodness we have those three cows because we're going to never see them again. <laughs> okay, let's actually scroll away from the roses. I do not want to be accidentally doing anything there. Nice. I wondered if I was ever going to be able to pick up that egg since we kept missing it. Uh, cool. It would be so amazing to kill this UFB really quickly, but... I mean, unfortunately, slow and steady is kind of our motto with the, uh, stud rifle. Oh, no. Please. Oh, God. And they're everywhere. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay, you, come back. No, that's, that's garbage. You should not be allowed to steal my animals like that. Hey, that's my cow. No. Okay, we should be able to kill this guy soon, right? And we definitely need to be harvesting those. Sorry. Okay, there's another one. No, 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 quit. Go home. Jeez. I hope, at the very least, they will make up for it by sending us a small, cute, um, alien to help us out on the farm. It's like a little internship or something for it. It's like, uh, that thing I was talking about before, where, you know, like, when you're not actually old enough to get a job, but then, like, they'll still, you know, have you, like, do a weird little farm internship or whatever. It's like that. But for the aliens. Okay. Honestly, we have a ton of roses. Um, I don't think we have quite enough to get married, but we're doing okay on them. Okay, we don't have any more turrets. We don't have any way to expand the farm. So we're actually just like kind of sitting here and I guess just chopping weeds in the meantime. You know, hoping they don't grow into anything worse, but it's almost morning, so I doubt anything else is going to actually get ready for us, unfortunately. Oh well. I mean, we're not doing horribly. You know, we're doing okay on health. We are surviving. We're doing, like, acceptable on cashews. Certainly nothing very good. But... Yeah, we still can't afford a shallot gun, unfortunately. Hi, Norman. Ah, oh, pigs. Okay, so we did lose one cow and all three chickens. Right? We had three? I feel like we had three. Oh, pocket squirrel. Exciting. These water crops is great, but we don't have any. Let's take a pig. And that way we can justify getting the pig turret. Because I think we could. Hmm. We don't really need watering, though. Honestly, maybe we'll skip it. I don't regret having the pig, though. I would like our farm to get expanded because we're really struggling in that department. Uh, I, 
I mean, I don't really care about getting jungle seed, so I guess I'm gonna say no on this. Weird as it is. Okay. Off we go. Here to hopefully survive our, our uh, not summer, it's autumn. Let's see what we can do. Where should we go? I guess we should probably actually go to Plains because um, we haven't fully explored it and then we can just go, we can pay the $200 to go to the advanced Plains area once we're, you know, in the vicinity. No reason not to. Okay, cool. Yeah, and we know we didn't really explore it northward, so that's really like our issue. I hate to leave like a fertilizer behind, but it doesn't ever seem economical to like pursue it to that degree. So, so I suppose I don't. Okay, and we'll go ahead and get these guys as well. Easy. Okay. So now we have kind of explored the area. We didn't find the uh, tundra uh, worm, the pupa, the golden pupa thing. Hmm, weird. Okay, we're gonna do this. We're gonna stick to our, our plan, you know? Since this is how we... Oh my god. Well, that's that's quite a that's quite an opener. Um, this is nice. It lets me know that like my fighting stat is just really not ready for this kind of this kind of adventure. Wow. Maybe I should have just gone to the jungle and been happy with my lot in life. Wow, that's awful. I mean, at least we need some fertilizer, I guess. But this is just this is a lot of time being killed for nothing. Oh. Okay. Wow. Oh, good, good. And we've gotten the attention of, you know, more of those weird bats. But instead of bats, they're just like, what, baby pterodactyls? Okay, rude, rude. But, hey, at least we're wasting, I mean using, at least we're using our organic armor. That's what we were supposed to do. We agreed. It's a plan. Make a little agenda there. Oh. We should take the seed. Oh, okay. I don't like how they can just like, you know, zoom up at you from uh, the other side of the screen, like from below, so you can't see it at all. Okay, we can get rid of the sharpshooter, right? This one, I think is just going to vomit up a bunch of fertilizer for us. Oh, he waits for us. That's very nice. Okay, uh, please go ahead, little guy. Thank you. Oh, and we got a heartbeat seed. That is quite nice. We don't need it yet, but I have no doubt that we will. Okay, let's head back. Okay, okay. So far so good, so far so good. Oh my goodness, I didn't realize we had uh, important crops here. Hey, maybe we'll get an alien? An alien? Okay, a cow. A cow's better than a chicken, I suppose. Oh, see, look, I told you we'd take some damage. It's a self-fulfilling prophecy right there. All right, let's try to get that weed killed. I mean, honestly, I am glad we got the chickens back. I know that I was I was dismissive of them, and I hope that they can find it in their hearts to forgive me because that was wrong of me. Uh, the way that the weeds are growing here is insane. Okay, everything's growing faster at night. Let's go ahead and get these plain seeds out there. I mean, whew, we're clearly we clearly have quite a few. Let's make sure also we fertilize everything with so much extra fertilizer. Okay, I got one of these guys. Let's definitely take them out. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I am a pretty big fan of, like, most potatoey starches. When I think about the spud cannon, of course. Um, and also the fact that, like, I'm hungry. But I'm basically always hungry, so that, that one's not, uh, perhaps particularly remarkable. But I would say, I am, I am a fan of, you know, basically any varietal of spud. I'm still trying to, like, get to a point in my life where I can handle sweet potato fries. Like, look, I get that they're, like, healthy, okay, and that that's great. I'm very glad that they're healthy, but I don't know. They're just, they're always, like, so, uh, this is dumb. They're always so sweet, right? I mean, like, I think that sweet potato pie is a truly excellent dessert. And, you know, of course, like, the whole sweet potato, well, I didn't realize it would just disappear like that. That's kind of nuts. Okay, we really need some more tundra beds, because, like, these tundra crops, they're, they're hooking us up, you know? So today isn't going to have like very much, yeah, 362, that's nothing, but I think that we'll be doing pretty good. Um, I think I only have one chicken, but we might get more chickens later. 
And this is this is okay. Shoot a bullet when a seed of fertilizer is picked up. Let's definitely take that. We'll marry you later, Norman. You're, you're beautiful. We love you. You're late for your human job, and I completely understand. Um, do we even have any at home that are not the winter king? I mean, the, the tundra garden beds. Those ones we have any other beds, but... I don't know. Raised garden beds are cool, but they got nothing on the coolness of um, aquaponics. Aquaponics is like the coolest thing ever. So, I mean, it's kind of hard to hold a handle to that anyway. Are you ready to harvest? Yeah, I was hoping that we would just sort of look. Let's rely on the pig to get that done. And let's go north and figure out what the hell is going on with, uh, we should also look for, when we get back today, let's look for the animals encased in goo, okay? Keep that in mind. Okay, we still have some organic armor. Oh, man, I don't think that this spud cannon can get the job done, but... Oh, it, it did, it did. Okay, we even got a little achievement for that. Okay, that's not bad. Awesome. Okay, so now we just have to figure out where exactly uh, we missed the pupa. And I mean, maybe it just like popped out somewhere and we didn't we didn't accept it, but I suspect, yeah, look, so there's two camps up here. There's a real chance we just, it's gonna come out of one of these, I think. Yep, look at that. Even better. I was a little bit nervous that we were just going on a wild goose chase here and just never find anything. But that's fine. Okay, so where's it gonna go? Oh, right up here for permanencies. Okay, let's wipe out this camp. Man, there were like three camps up here we fully missed despite the whole map being filled in. Upsetting. Ooh, okay, okay. Okay, crampons. That's cool. Uh, I wish we had the chrono weeds then. Did I pass it up this time? God, I hope I didn't. <laughs> that would, that would be painful. Okay, so let's get back as soon as we can. Unfortunately, that's just going straight down, I think. Oh, straight down towards the actual bridge, so. All right, the road kind of tells you where to go. Huh, man, like, because I really want to, I'd like to go back to here, but we don't really have, like, that kind of time. No, we don't have that kind of time at all. You can see that there. Um, I wish that one would hurry up. Like, what are, what are you doing, little guy? What kind are you even? No, that's cabbage. This must be you. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, kind of obviously. Um, I'm really looking to put these roses down. And we could at least marry Norman. Most adorable office worker, you know? I mean, I wish I had that kind of dedication to being, like, worried about being late for my human job, you know? I'm like, eh, they're lucky that I show up at all, you know? Maybe <laughs> it's not a good attitude, but <laughs> it is the one I've got. Okay. This can be a four square soon. Okay, rude, rude. Give us a... Come here and give us the dove scrolls we get for putting up with you. Okay. Still trying, still failing. Nice. Uh, maybe, okay, X? I don't even know where that is. I feel like I roughly know where that is on the keyboard, but like, I don't know. I don't trust my touch typing in a high stress situation like this. See, look, we just we use, we use. We do not waste, we use. Um, man, this is, this is awful. Uh, okay, so X. We're okay. Okay, okay. We're good. We're good. Look at us go. We're good. Oh my gosh. Okay, at least we got a bee drop from it. Hey, lady, move. Okay. Well, now I'm starting to feel like I'd like to get the, uh, the heartbeat down, you know? Okay, was that a pumpkin? No, it was a sunflower seed. Oh, well, duh. The pumpkin seeds look like, uh, the, the things you expect them to. Candy corn. I don't know why I say the things you expect them to. Pumpkin seeds don't like that at all. Pepitas uh, are not, they, they do not have that distinctive look. Okay. 
Oh, hey, I finally got a pickaxe. Okay, hey, okay, okay, look at this. We're gonna get a little rose section down. Okay. It'll be good for our day length. Oh, man. I assumed that we would just be able to protect it. Like, in my mind, I was like, oh, yeah, no no worries there. I'm sure we'll be fine. I mean, look, this, this like, that bean, it's still growing. You know, it's the same bean still. Still trying their best. I mean, the good news is we really do get a lot from this. Um, okay. Yeah. I'm going to put a heartbeat down as well. Okay, go away, you guys. That's not very cool. Awesome. Whoa! Wow, do you see that one just like waiting to murder me? Also, you know what else you saw? Hello. A chicken. Okay. And hopefully we'll find another. Hmm. Well, I mean, I guess it would have been terrible to actually see another one of the animals trapped in there since we wouldn't get it at all. And we would just have to like, you know, in like swallow that devastation. Uh, oh god, I never remember to use my tractors. Okay, well good, we can't afford anything. I love when that happens. Uh, I don't really care to buy any particular seeds, I think. Actually, how much is he selling a heartbeat seed for, though? Oh, a thousand? No, thank you. We'll never afford another gun again. The whole rest of the game. You know, we only have two seasons left, so there's no way. Okay, uh... Let's combine these little guys. Um, maybe put a pickaxe here. We don't have any more, like, beds for it, either. Maybe we just don't have, like, our, our seed tiers up very high? I don't know. I don't know. Let's just go ahead and, like, throw something down in all of these spaces. This one. Let's make this a regular part of this whole breakfast. Isn't that what the ads used to say? Okay. Wow. Okay. Yep. Finally. Jeez. Okay. Now, we'll throw down the desert seeds everywhere and hopefully get some kind of upgrade. And then when we do, uh, then the upgrade will be good for us. I mean, we'll get like a tundra bed out of it or something. Okay, so I know where we're going. Hello, chicken. You're a good friend. Okay. Nice, nice. We'll go say hi to this gopher and then... What? What? Why are they all back? Did we not, like, we didn't wipe out the camp so it doesn't, it doesn't count or something? Is that what happened? Because I, I fully remember these guys. Maybe the, maybe these, like, the, the not camp camps, uh, like, you can't clear them or something? I don't know. Of course, I guess I could see that I might have missed one, just like that guy there. I probably shouldn't go just, like, straight in, right? I should probably, like, oh god, we're gonna accidentally hit that weird snake. Oh, there's multiple weird snakes. Oh, man. Don't get me started talking about snakes. I do need to run and get snake food, too. Oh, my gosh. Did that one just spawn, or, like, does it just feel like that to my brain? Because I wouldn't put either of them past the game or my brain, for that matter. Wow, I wish they would go away. Okay, we could totally take these guys out. Look, it'll be too easy. Oh, my goodness, please. Oh, oh, I did just walk into that one. Okay, that's fair, that's fair. Remember, I can't lean back. No leaning back in my chair. That's not the right posture for what we need here. Okay, whatever. Wow, okay, let's let's not approach them. We have a heartbeat growing back at the house, right? Right? <laughs> I feel like we do. Okay, please, please, cockroaches. There's too many of you. There's too much going on. Like, go away. Oh, man. I mean, like, that's that's kind of like their trade-off, right? Like, how unpopular they are is their trade-off between, oh, my goodness. Between being so resilient. Sure, go ahead and catch me. I don't want to stay here. Oh, no. Okay, we got this guy. Okay, let's make sure. Okay. Yes. I don't want three. I want, I want the Tundra ones. Yes. Yes, this is excellent. Okay, okay. Uh, let's clear this up. Oh, hey, slug, go away. Okay, I know that we're wasting, like, precious, precious time here. And that it's very bad when you're trying to, uh... When you're trying to get these guys taken care of. I know you gotta, like, go hard at them from the beginning, because otherwise they'll just continue multiplying and conquering, as they say. 
Um, but I think we can do it. We're still in wave one. Okay. Yes, we let them. We let them continue for a little bit, un unimpeded. But I think that we can totally smush them out now. Um, and of course, speaking of fungus, um, I have not watched the penultimate. No, the ultimate. The ultimate episode, right? Because penultimate is the, uh, you know, second to last. Um, right? Or is penultimate the last one? Okay, see, I'm clearly gonna have to Google this later. But, um, I haven't watched the last episode of The Last of Us. And I'm, like, so nervous, too. You know? Because, like, you know how, you know how this show is. It's just this exercise in, like, stress and fear and heartbreak, you know? It's, like, emotionally devastating. I'm like, why do I even like this, you know? So... Anyway, I'm thinking I'll probably get around to watching it today, though. <laughs> that being said... Okay, come on. These guys have to be almost done now. There's two of you here. That's right. That's right. That's what I want to see. Okay. Oh, uh, they must have been getting eaten, because I would expect them to be pretty well handled by now in terms of growth. Okay. Yes, I want more Tundra things for sure and I want to keep growing them together because I think that's going to be good for them go away um okay I'm at a tundra garden bed okay let's kill this guy I don't like the interruptions with my very important tundra bed planting okay wow Oof. I mean we've, we've had to push this guy into a fully different biome like because of like how awful he is okay see that's what I'm talking about go away <laughs> okay, cool. Okay, let's get rid of these weeds. Okay, we can make some of this stuff a little bit more cohesive. Maybe here? Do we have any date trees? We do not. That's not great. Hmm. I'm not sure exactly where I should put these, but it's alright. Well, we could finally afford something better. Maybe the rusty SMG. I know it's not incredibly good. Norman, just wait a second. We'll get married after the festival here. After we've celebrated surviving fall. Okay. Uh, I like that we have a gourd. And another gourd. The scarecrow situation is terrible. We can still marry... Yeah. We can still marry Norman. If we take the bees. So, yeah. A hummingbird and three bees. I mean, like, this will actually help a ton with uh, what we've got going on with Mary Norman. Let's go find some tasty seeds. He's completely right. Jungle crops have a 10% chance to mature instantly. Um, that kind of sucks, <laughs> like, I'll be honest. We don't have enough cashews now? I thought we had enough. Oh, well. Did I buy something that I shouldn't have? Hmm. Hmm. Well, okay. Clearly, it's too late to worry about that. Let's move on with our lives. Um. Okay. Let's just let's just get some seeds down. I mean, we have a hundred of these, so let's just let's just frantically just plant them before we go. I think that that makes the most sense. Yep. Good. Good. We're nice and energized. So just plant these with all open areas. Okay. We can fertilize them up. Uh, let's do that. Come on, let's keep fertilizing. Oh, that's a turret in the way. I should really move that turret. That's a really terrible place to put it. I, I got hit by something? Oh, man. Truly. My folly knows no bounds. Okay, let's go this way. Okay, we still have... I hope Norman's doing okay over there. Okay, so we still have... It says we're in the top left corner top right no we're here in the middle of this plains okay this is very weird um that's fine i guess i should have just taken the gopher clearly i like how my own inability to read maps has cost us like 20 seconds it's great uh, i know what i should be getting myself for my birthday you know um obviously cartography lessons okay i'm gonna ignore those because they're terrible, and I want nothing to do with them. I don't know what it's showing me, what this weird icon is in the top left. Um, it just does not seem 
It does not seem useful. I'm gonna keep going. Now we're down here. Okay, see this is much better. So we can get some more roses, maybe get some better, better gear from folks. I'm sure these gourds are helping me too. Quite sure. Okay, oh, yep, I was like, maybe I should wait a second before I hit that snake, but nope, nope. I'm gonna go ahead and attack the snake. I do like their very cozy little nest. Like, I get that it's supposed to be like a hole in the ground or something, but you can clearly see that it's a nest. So, I think it's quite cute. I hope they're happy in it. Hmm. I don't really want the tractor. I mean, I can't even remember to use the tractor I have. Hey, you know what? Speaking of which, why don't we just put it there and then have them destroy them and give us fertilizer? Okay. I mean, it seems like very useful. Honestly, like the invincibility frames, I know, I know, but like, can I even trust myself as it, as it stands, you know? Wow, I can't believe, okay, yeah, I was like, I clearly need to take damage. I just can't see that not being deserved. Oof, all right, okay. Uh, there was some kind of benefit we got for Scarecrows recently, so I'm gonna do that. I think I just like accidentally used another freaking dove. I need to move, uh, well, I was going to say I need to move the shift key, but I'm probably not about to do that. It's hardly the shift key's fault that I behave in this way. Um, and anyway, because my hands are kind of small, I move, uh, okay, a plains garden bed. Okay, good. So we have a ton of plain seeds. Okay, please. It's very, like, very busy here, uh, really. You can't help but, uh, notice that. Oh, gosh. We got a bead drop from it, though, which is nice, I guess. Man. I know we're just getting bullets every time we pick up fertilizer, but it does not feel like it is enough. Nice idea for a buff, though. Okay, please, go away. Awesome. Oh gosh, okay. It is handy, because I mean, it basically means like as you kill things, you get extra bullets, you know, which is valuable. Okay, so I was about to say, I think, I think the whole night is like gone, which is kind of a shame. But let's go ahead and try to get some more space available. That way we can set up another one of the garden beds, which will be good. It does not seem too terrible. Okay. Oh, wow. There's no way we can afford that. <laughs> cool. Oh, right. Okay. I don't really care about becoming energized when a tractor is used, given that, you know, that would require me to remember about the tractors. And I clearly can't do that at all. Okay. Let's go back to the farm. Let's make sure we put down these plain seeds somewhere. Okay. Go away. Uh, maybe we should put out... Gosh, I don't know. I was thinking of putting it here originally, but... I guess that's fine. There's plenty of other space to expand. Um, let's get the roses down. I do kind of want to get... I like how I can... You know, I'm very economical in this game. You know, I am... Um... Okay, let's get this out of here. Yeah, that, that should not stay there. Okay, so put this here. And then we should put the scarecrow... Someplace else like this, yeah. Okay. And then this, and then we gotta go for sure. We can't just keep messing around here. This is obviously a terrible decision. Okay. Yeah, wish I would stop just staying here though. That obviously isn't what I should be doing. Okay. So, I mean, this, this one is fairly well cleared out. I feel like I still don't know what's going on. Oh, that maybe is where we defeated the... The tree thing? Is that what that is? Hmm. Okay, weird and confusing. Nice to have that going on. I just, I do want to put down the heartbeat seed. I don't trust me. I mean, you probably shouldn't either, for being honest. Okay. So, 
We can get rid of some of these weeds. Oh, we haven't even gone down to the jungle at all. That's right, I forgot. I'm doing things a little out of order today, huh? Okay. I mean, look, but we could survive. You know, we're already on the second day of winter, so it is completely possible. This is finally the run that we conquer year three, which would be honestly really exciting. Uh, I guess the fertilizer. I shouldn't have taken the fertilizer. Well, I mean, I don't really have a watering problem either. Okay. Oh, look, we have a heartbeat cooking back home. Oh, geez. I do not like those cats. They are the worst. Okay, we'll go ahead and stat up our fighting skill. Look, I know, I know, but it just feels like, it feels like it's what we need to be able to continue clearing things out and like surviving the evenings. I mean, it doesn't feel like, you know, is it really gonna help us to have like more, uh, more watering can space? Because I don't feel like the answer to that question is yes. Um, cool. Getting lots of good stuff in this one. Okay. I'm going to still just kind of go left and maybe be a little bit more methodical with this one. Okay, going left seems like it was kind of a complete failure of judgment. Nice, nice. Uh, hmm. Come on. Where's the last one? How many bees do we have? We have a ton of bees. We do, yeah. We don't have anything that makes our turrets better either. Well, let's take a bee. Why not? Let's get back. Okay, perfect. Okay, so this way, even if we take some damage, honestly, having two gourds is, like, probably saving me entirely. I mean, look at that. I could, well, okay, that one was a bad example, but I was basically able to just, like, walk forward and continue attacking that guy just the whole time because the gourd blocks so much damage, you know? It was pretty nice. Oof. Okay. We're doing it. We're alive. We're alive. Who knows if it's for long, but... Okay, we got this little guy. Oh yeah, totally should make sure we fertilize them all up. Okay. I mean, it's kind of crazy too, like how much you really need here in this game to like do well, because I, I feel like, you know, we're doing not, not too bad, right? But like, I still can't afford anything. You know, I can't afford new guns. Um, you know. But, like, we've got these, like, four Tundra crop beds. I mean, they're basically exactly what I was hoping they would be. You know, like, they're constantly growing and giving us money. So, okay, please don't eat them, though. That's really not great. Okay, we've taken a bit of damage. All garden beds till moist soil. Sure. Okay, that seems better. We don't even have to wait for the cows to get around to their job. Okay, that sucks. Gourds, I thought you were doing something for me. Yeah, um, I definitely do think, even though it cost us the organic armor, that it was probably the right call to take the stat up since we haven't had a new gun in, you know, I don't know, a season or two. Okay, wow, that's terrible what's going on there. Please stop. Okay. Well, we definitely lost some of them. I guess that explains what's going on there. But, uh, yeah, okay. Okay, okay. Look, we're gonna, we're gonna be just fine. We'll put this down somewhere. Somewhere. Maybe here. Okay. Oh, that's right. Um, harvesting roses makes the days last longer. Okay. I was like, I don't know what they're doing, but for some reason they're not picking us up. Okay, cool. That's all right. We'll go ahead and we'll plant some more of these seeds. Maybe it'll all work out for us. Okay. Hmm. Uh, lard is incredible. The turrets uh, firing faster is great. We don't really need more watering. I mean, we still have three cows and not that much space. Biodegrader. We can almost afford it. Almost. Okay. We got a couple of trees. It'd be cool to put them down somewhere, I guess, before we head out. Okay, make sure everything's fertilized. I mean, I do want some more heartbeat seeds, honestly, just in case uh, everything falls apart just like it did recently. So with that being said, let's just put down this peach. No, I can't. Okay, there we go. We'll put down this peach tree. It doesn't have anything yet, but maybe it will in the future. 
And then, oh good, and then we can put the apple trees here and I can be confused about them later. Oh, let's see. Go away. Okay. Yeah, that's somewhat confusing. Maybe I should just put this one here. That way there would be a separate space. And then let's just do these two. And then we'll get them out of here. Okay, cool. Well, at least now we'll have more passive things going on that maybe will help us out. Right, we're still heading down here. Okay, I don't know where that one is blinking. Maybe to say that's the one we the path we took back. I'm not sure what's going on there, but that's fine. Okay. Um, cool. Well, let's hope. Oh god, I accidentally aggroed the cat. This is terrible. Although, I mean, in fairness, all of the cats I've known in real life were a little crazy, too, I think. Um, I've only had two cats, and they were both strays um, before, like, I adopted them or whatever. And so, one of them we got as an extremely small kitten, you know, like, um, eyes recently opened, you know, like, basically, like, just, just old enough to survive on their own. Um, and so since that one was, like, never really raised with a parent, uh, it was, it was an extremely uncat-like cat. It just did not know how to be a cat. I mean, like, I learned to use the litter box and stuff, but it was just very, very, very weird and uncat-like and not particularly sociable. So, I mean, maybe, maybe that's what's wrong with this cat, too. I don't know. Who am I to judge? Um, and then, of course, I mean, we had a pretty nice cat that was uh, a stray as well. But that one was like, you know, it was a, oh god, daily orchard. I know I should have taken the horse. I know I should have. Oh, this is winter. I was thinking it was fall. Well, we certainly should have taken it then. Because the, we get so much more value out of the horse. Okay, it's very weird that he's here on the way out, but it's fine. Maybe we'll kill the Undertaker really quickly. Uh, even though he falls asleep at a certain point of damage, so it's like virtually impossible. But hey, don't don't even don't even stress about that, okay? We'll stay on him. He'll fall asleep. I'll take more damage. It's perfect. It's everything I hoped for. Wow, we just can't seem to even knock him out, huh? I thought it was like at a quarter or a half. Okay, perfect. It is. Can we have another apple seed? Uh, cool. The desert one's creating their own seeds is great, and definitely something I was hoping we'd get to see. We still only have two heartbeats. Seeds, I mean. So that's not ideal. Wow. I kind of need, uh... I guess I need to keep him near my care or my, uh, my turrets, because we're really <coughs> not doing a ton of damage by ourselves. Really, rabbit? Okay, hey, look, I got more, uh... <clears throat> more heartbeat seeds. Apparently the secret is just taking tons of damage, so actually we'll be fine. Okay, please don't eat that. Please don't attack me. Wow, there are so many little rabbits. I mean, I know that this can happen, but... See, this is like keeping mammals is a bad idea. Oh my goodness. Wow, okay. Remember, don't lean back in your chair, it's bad for your gaming. Or at least that's, uh, that's my idea. Hey, we got a four, uh, we have four sunflowers, so we can potentially have a four square of sunflowers, which is great. It seems like you would be awake by now, doesn't it? I feel like you should be awake by now. Okay, there we go. But I don't know, I don't know what kind of schedule he keeps. Really? Those rabbits snuck up on me like that? Okay, we have to just stay, we have to stay out of the crop area as much as, as much as it would be nice to, because, oh my goodness. Because I, I can't see them as well there. Okay, come on. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, excellent work. We're still alive. So maybe not like excellent work, but better than no work. Okay. Please stop. Okay, that's extremely rude. Wow, they just, they don't leave, huh? Okay. Excellent. Oh, that's right, they'll all grow because this is the last day of winter. Oh, hey, look, look, a heartbeat. Uh, is this a four square area? Yes. So, one, two, three, four. Okay, we didn't quite get the fourth one down, but we'll be able to at least plant it, if nothing else. That won't be too bad. Okay. 
I mean, it could have been a worse year, right? Clearly, all the townspeople, uh, they did not get completely stuffed, but they're, they're fine, you know? Look, a shroom mates. Painful, painful. I don't know I should have taken the horse, though, earlier. Definitely is what I should have taken. Okay, so we have three... Three roses. It's probably better to take... There was something up there I thought seemed interesting. Oh, it was hummingbirds. I don't know. And they're four, anyway. Okay, well, that's fine. I can just ignore that, then. Let's see. Okay. I'm ready to hopefully, at last, get a win here. Sriracha soaker seems good. Uh, a cow is, like, fine. This is cheap, so now I'll have another set of heartbeats. Hopefully we live long enough to see, uh, ooh, a tundra garden bed. That's worth it. Oh, we can't afford a cow now, that's okay. Okay, so hopefully we get there, we finish getting that one, uh, heartbeat ready. That's the plan, okay? We just try not to take any damage until then. Okay, we've been welcomed to his field of screams, which seems pretty rude since it was previously, like, my farm. But that's alright, I guess. Okay, uh, and then how about we just don't die? We just stand here and we just don't die. I'm so, so nervous about the whole not dying thing. I mean, I know that we, we should be okay. Uh, X? Okay. So we should go ahead and put this down so that, you know, when he catches everything on fire, it's not such a damning issue. Please, Heartbeat, I'm really waiting for you. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, God, it's like the cat's all over again. Okay, 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 okay. Whew. We will probably not die immediately now. <laughs> I mean, maybe that's not a great assurance, but look, and we're sending those carrots to him? I mean, that's, that's where it's at. Let's use our scroll. I mean, no reason not to. Probably a good idea to even. It's great when the inverse or the the converse works out like that. Okay. With the Sriracha Soaker here, it even seems to be pretty useless. I'm now checking on our fighting stats there. Wow. Oh, and we're like out of ammo for it too. <laughs> Excellent. Oh God. This is quite quite chaotic. I mean, with like the weird things in your field of vision like that, mm, not my favorite. Okay, remember not to hit the weird floating uh, veg skulls or whatever they're called. Okay, we got these going. It's okay, it wants to try to set everything on fire again, but we, we should be good to go, okay? We've got cows galore, we got things we can harvest, we can fertilize them to send them back together. Don't run into the skulls, it's fine, even though they're not well lit. Don't hit them. You're doing great. I've accidentally sewn a heartbeat seed somewhere? Because now, look, I only have three? Oh, God. Where'd I put it? Okay. Oh, hey, we have the, the four sunflower seeds. Okay, let's, let's go ahead and put those down. This seems good. Okay, this should do a fair amount of damage. We'll harvest those, too. Oh, we gotta get rid of this guy before he tries to do the exploding thing that is not good for us. That's weird, there must be one on the field, too. Yep. How rude. Okay, I'm gonna have to evict you. Apologies. Okay, and now we can go ahead and get these out here. Oh, hello. That seems great, them merging without a fertilizer. I like how it allowed me to go ahead and like get my one last upgrade. Okay. Woo! -hoo! I cannot believe that like, I actually, oh gosh, we can finally marry the Deerville, huh? Oh no. Well, we're not gonna be in a rush to do that. Looks like this is an all time best with a kind of measly, but let's call it a whopping 34,137. So I'm just going ahead and taking a look at, um, I like to watch the, you know, see how the farm expanded. So it kind of grew into a weird little strawberry shape. All right, well, awesome. I mean, like, this went uh, better than I'd hoped and not even worse than I'd feared, you know? Um, it worked out pretty well, I think. So uh, that's that's pretty great. Uh, I appreciate you watching. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up there, but thank you for tuning in. Um, I had a blast. I'm super excited for the punishment that year four will bring. Uh, looks like year three was actually the year for me. So thanks so much. Have a good one.